don't know why Twitch keeps fucking kicking me off. That's crazy. Am I like a low priority streamer? <laughs> God, why is it reset on each zone? one way literally the only other possible way and it's a lot of backtracking because this game's fucking mm. hmm fun Build clear. I mean, <sighs> I really thought this was gonna go differently. What about melee splash? 
Maybe that's what I need. I feel like Ancestral Call is just a better version of that, though. It really is. Can you like get out of the fucking death? I feel like I need melee spoiler. I, I think I need to at least try it. This is like scuff. School fade, if you will. Um, the thing is, I don't think I get melee splash as an option. It's like Ranger. They're like, Ranger, you're not melee. What are you talking about? It's like, sir? Oh, there it is. Cool. I lied. I was trying to talk more melee splash area of effect. I mean, yeah, that's cool. It's my withering step. Meme, lol, okay. Let's just try this for a second. Fortify up. That's a bit concerning. Hmm. Cut. You know, I should get out of here. Yeah, I'm actually gonna die. Let's not. Cool. And we're back to zero plague stack. Yay! Why is my- I bet you this has- no, it has attack. What the fuck? Maybe I'm clicking too close to my character? That might be a thing, uh... Oh, I probably have no mana. That's- that would make sense. I really need, like, an Enduring Flask. Yeah, or to just not reserve my entire fucking mana bar. But that, that I don't like that option. <laughs> That's probably a smart play, though. Kill the remaining art into the top. Right, well, let's try this melee splash change. Oh. Oh. I'm missing every shot, but there we go. That seems a lot better. Wait, is that... Am I dumb? Should I have been using it this whole time and I'm just dumb? 
Is my character even teleporting around? Oh my god, wait, what the fuck? Why am I not using that? What, am I dumb? Do I think I'm dumb? Yo, this dude's about to get cut. Prepare this? Oh wait, I didn't mean to take it. Okay, well, well now we're here. Oh my god, we've been doing this all wrong. We've been going about this all freaking wrong. We just do melee splash. We clap these fucking cheeks. Spread the AIDS. <laughs> spread the AIDS as in spread the chaos. <laughs> Clap these cheeks and spread that ass. <laughs> I just got skipped real quick. Um, well, melee splash feels a lot better. Uh, the situation being the mana is because I don't have an enduring flask. Oh shit, okay. I'm um, 42. I need two more levels and then I'll have one. We should probably actually like dodge stuff and do mechanical things. Whoop! Ow. Wait, what did you do to that hurt me so much? These little things give me so much like... So many stacks of that bomb. Fuck this. Ooh, burn, baby, burn. That is cheesy good. That is cheesy good. Oh my god. I'm low on health flasks, which is not good. What's up, fam? Come on. Let's go. I remember I wanted to go for that attack speed node. The attack speed leech, that's what I wanted. Ow. Wait, did I not kill this? I did not. But we are at full virulence, so we should be able to just do this. Here we come. Oh, hello. Hello. Who behind you? Wait, what? Wait. Can I, can I, can I hit him? We're just gonna be over here. Whoop. What if I put my level ones back on? I mean, knock on wood, the flask reach end seems pretty good because of all the ads. So we can just do this. I 
Ah, see, that's the thing, though, is that, like... I gotta get smoke... You know what? I gotta link smoke mine with blood magic. That would be big. Because then it stops, like, scuffing. Like, I don't, like, kill my own escape when I'm messed up my mana. Which is, like, always. No. Oh, wait. <laughs> Come on. Fucking portal. Oh, wait. I actually did want to do that, I think. Alright, well. Might actually be big. I do need ink AoE. Away from my plague bearer. Oops. I wanted to try multi strike, even though it's probably a bad idea. So, what did I get rid of? I'd have to get rid of either lesser poison, which I'd have to have 40% poison on the tree. I don't think my sentencing gives any, right? One day I'm gonna get that fucking. Oh shit. I feel like the build isn't necessarily doing bad. I just don't know if this is the right ascendancy, actually. Like, now that I think about it, like, I thought it was. But if it's not doing what I want, what I thought it was doing, there might be a good answer here. Just being a different ascendancy. You can do it on the, the assassin. Um, does he get a lot of attack speed? No, not at all. Speed, chance to dodge, dodge, 15 percent attack speed while elusive. His Mistwalker does. If he can crit enough, he can get a lot of attack speed. Um, what about Raider? If I switch to Raider, I mean the poison steal double damage is like huge on Pathfinder, but I'm not really stacking poison as much as I thought it was like. Attack damage, chance to evade hits, chance to gain onslaught, cool, evading, attack damage, I mean, yeah. It would be like the same thing, I'd just be fucking clapping poisons instead of uh, Raider might actually be the play. They just run around with Onslaught all fucking day, clap and just... You know? I feel like this guy's not strong enough to just redo his lab, though. <laughs> oh, dear. Um... Right, I did also want to see about actually switching the links around. This is Armory V, right? Yeah. So we can just... Let me see. So if we drop Deadly Ailments, which is like, not good, but we got Multi-Strike, we would generate faster. 
um, which is really, I don't know, probably bad, but I kind of want to try it. The melee splash is a big, a big boost. Um, let's do these, right? Let's just throw this in here. This just needs to be anywhere. Um, I can't put this anywhere. We'll hold it for now, but we need... Oh, we can do that with Blasphemy too. No. Um, Plague Bearer... This just doesn't... isn't needed. Increased AoE is for Plague Bearer. I could probably get like Intensify, but I think Intensify reduces the damage. To do the AoE. Have to check. There'll be a whole separate thing, but that could be insane AoE. More area damage with hits. Well, it's not doing a hit. Less area of effect, increased area of effect. While moving, yeah, so as long as I'm not standing still, it would have huge AoE, and then if I'm standing still, it loses AoE. And you cast them. Oh, actually, not really. It would just be a big AoE gem, and like that's it. Um, hmm. Holy crap. That's 23k. And now we're incubating. Whoa. Let me do this. And then we incubate. I mean, and then we. Ho ho ho! What? What is this ethical blade vortex? Like, <laughs> wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. And this just does chaos damage per second, right? I have deals chaos damage per second with 12% of each. Um, when you inflict poison, it's 40% of the expected. So that should technically work with Pathfinder's Ascendancy. Technically, it should be giving me, like, when I kill an enemy, big fucking chunks of it. Technically. So this, this is just sending it. And we do this. This is just crazy. Like absolutely insane. And we do this. I think, oh my god, I think this is a thing. Yo, this feels like a thing. Like, look at that, I just crush it, and I blitz. Now the question is, is it just melee strike that's making that so multi strike that's making that so good? Um, or melee splash or yeah, those yeah words. 
Is it just melee splash that's making it so good, or is multi strike actually helping? That's the question. So it's like three hits to get like uh that might multi strike might be better. Hmm, it's very hard to say. But I think one thing for sure is that um Fucking cuts. I just do. Oh, oh, oh. Right, I don't have fortify yet. That's gonna be a big important thing. I'm probably gonna end up losing multi strike for that, sadly. But it's kind of like a good thing on. Hmm, okay, so it's good to be around then. The melee splash is definitely big. Pretty fucking cut. So tax speed is definitely like a big help for making it feel good. Yet, no. This is crazy. Like, Plague Bear is actually like my main. Uh, like, Viper Strike is punching shit, right? It has to punch it to get a good Plague Bear going. Or get it going in a reasonable amount of time. And then we just kinda. Wait, is this going away? Oh, crap. I do think we want <clears throat> it's gonna be two red, two green. It's just I think the other red instead of multi strike is gonna end up being 
um, fortify, obviously. So if we can get that, the sooner we can get that, the better. Look at this. Fucking cheesy. It's like Blade Vortex, like... But ethical. Ethical Blade Vortex. This is crazy! Oh no, man. Oh no, man. I need fortify. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to do the thing with the socket, too. Um, I think we want Onslaught, right? Yeah. Or Stib Knight. Probably Stib Knights already have onslaughts, right? Yeah, that would make sense. Just gotta resist. Prefixes are full, but I mean, be a lot of um, res if we needed. Increased effect reduced duration? No. No, no, no. Hey, wait, we got a sock right here now. Oh, but that doesn't have the decks, right? Just wait, what is this doing? Deals 20% increased damage with hits and poison for each poison on the enemy. 10% per poison grant unholy might. Um, pretty sure that's really good. Now, this would be... How much decks do I need? 40 decks. Ten, twenty, thirty. Uh oh. Oh no way! It's actually like. Oh, wait, did that right there? Ten, twenty, thirty, forty. As long as those are all in it. Yeah, which they are. As long as I do this. Yeah, okay, good. So we can put it right here. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Now, where do we get fortified from? Cause that's... Yo, what's up, cats? Yo, I... Uh, I'm really sorry. I don't know what's going on, but I'm... I haven't been dropping. Like, I had the... The two drops way earlier and all the rest after that. I've just been Twitch dropping. Like, I don't even know what's going on. I just notice I have no viewers. I look at Twitch and it says I'm off. Like, it's just, it makes it look like I'm off, but I just hit refresh and I'm on. Like, there's some shysty shit going on. <laughs> Fucking, I don't know what. Something shysty, though. But on a brighter note, um, we've pretty much just been scaling Plague Bear. Actually, still alive, Pog. Yo, no, you're actually gonna you're gonna be surprised. Let me get Fortify and then switch back over. We did some shit, and actually, the guy started popping off. Like our character actually started popping off really quick with a couple changes. Um, let me just finish one more of them. This one. So. I'm gonna start saying it. So, one thing we switched out Ancestral Call for Melee Splash. That alone is actually a humongous benefit for us. Um, I think it has to do with like the fact that it just does enough damage now. I don't know, but it, but that was huge for like everything, killing, getting poison stacks, everything, right? Um, so that was cool, and we started scaling off Plague Bear. Like we gave it increased AOE and. We're just pretty much trying to um, get fast attacks. Uh, well, we're getting rid of multi-strike, but that was cool too. But we're just like, 
getting quick stacks with melee splash and then popping off a plague bearer and that's it like that's the whole play but like watch ready like look at this and now this is with fortify look at this and this isn't even my this isn't even me popping off yet we're at 11 12 13k and i think the pathfinder is actually affecting us in the way we wanted so like this is scuffed because this is single target and I'm slowed, but then I could just do this. And like that's the 40% life like bonus essence guy. And like now we could just cruise and we do like this. And then we just kind of go meow. And we start doing like this where it's like literally ethical blade vortex. Oh, so we're out. No, I don't want that Ice Nova. But yeah, Melee Splash pretty much was like a game changer. Like right here we're done incubating, we just do this. Like this champs, boom, deleted. Big damage. If this were Grimdo instead of Peewee, that would be pretty pug. Oh, what, the damage and everything? Like, yeah, well... Uh, okay, okay, look. Look, for the fact that it's like, I have, you know, like, League Start gear, and they're not dropping rares. I mean, I got Goldrum, but that's not helping my damage, okay? And, um, like, this is pretty good. Like, this is pretty good clearing right here for this... This dog shit league where everything has 40% more health and there's no rares or blues. Like, it's pretty good for that, but then the big thing is this. Like, this and the fact that now I have Fortify too. Like, really, this is that, like, that right there. Those bursts are crazy clear bursts. Like, it actually completely. It's righteous <laughs> Well, no, yeah, but like, there's also like, as soon as I hit 40, oh wait, I hit 42. Now I can put on an enduring mana flask, and now I can actually use malevolence if I can figure out how to how to get it in somewhere. Um, this is actually yeah, it's actually good. Okay, wait. Um, we actually need to fix. We need to get blue somewhere. So I either want this to be green, green, red, red, which would probably be the best bet. Now that I know that that's what I want. Or... There we go. We just do this. And I just need blue on here anywhere. There we go. You are not the first man that struggles to get it. <laughs> well, at least I know I'm not alone. Oh dear. Oh dear. Alright, let's get back to this here. Look at that 20, 24, and a nice big clump like that. Like, look at that. Oh my god, everything got cooked. I'm a 38k plague bear, which means I do this. Dude. This is becoming less scuffed. This is becoming a lot less scuffed. No. Like, I literally have ethical blade vortex. Oh my god, I could get whirling blades too. I don't really need that though, that's silly.
Oops, I thought I hit this button. Okay, I just finished my cereal back to race. Ooh, damn. Yo, what kind of cereal you got? I still eat cereal all the time. I, fucking, I swear by it. Like mixed fruit with nuts. Oh, what? Is that like... Wait, so like it's not like a regular brand of cereal? Like, you custom make your cereal? Is that real? That's awesome if that's what you're saying. I don't think I'm ready for this. Uh, it is a brand but a German. But you can mix your cereal with the thing. Oh, so that was pop. Nice, nice. Funny story, me too. <laughs> Way. I really wanted to get up here. So I think one, two, three. One, two, three. I could try doing like poison and bleeding. How weird would that be? Like. I guess I didn't save it. Okay, 65. Time for explodey chest. Wait, it's 68. <laughs> oh, yeah, you have the explodey chest on deck waiting. Like, ready to go. God damn. Is it fat? Is it like a super thick explodey chest? Or is it just like explodey mod, like 70 life, like nothing crazy? Um. What did I want to do? Oh, I wanted to look at something over here. I wanted to see, like... Okay, so that's the shortest way there, but... The DPS is 190. That's nothing. It might as well not be there. Yeah, no, this thing is not doing any bleed damn. Hmm. Cool damage per poison. 
Brand new PS. Probably plus frenzy and an open prefix. It's the frenzy one. I don't know the frenzy way. Edge of Brotherhood or whatever, the thing that's worth like many X. Take the GG amulet for like, uh, I think the BV Spurs will use it. Hmm. Damn! Attack damage, that's like 30 damn. Combined damage, 12%, yeah, that's pretty big. It's like one. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, this was the one. This was like humongous damage the dots so like the thing is I feel like yeah my poison DPS is actually dog shit oh wait poison DPS versus total damage per poison wait these are very different okay. how is this calculating my poisons does anyone know how POV works with poison I feel like it's acting like I have all of them. Hmm. Oh, let's just try this fucking fight. Oh, scuffed fighting coming. Here we go. Put that in a better spot. Like that thing's gonna get in the way. Okay. Can we like save maybe some of it at least? Dude's doing good. This is a 40% HP boss. He may, he may very well still kill me, but at least I'll go out doing some damn.
Oh my god, come on. Oh, I'm gonna use it. I don't want to use the poison shit, but it's like... Ugh. I just realized I wasn't using my flask to spread the poisons on those guys. Ugh. Amateur plays over here. I wonder if this guy gets trapped. I don't think he cares. We don't care about nothing. Oh no, it's it's the Galaga. Oh no, ooh, ooh. E, ooh, e, ooh, yikes. Um, let's just go get flask and fix keyboard. Whoa, there she goes. Okay, where'd you go? Anyways. God damn, why do you keep doing that? Um, that could kill me, okay. This fight is so fucking dog shit. Everything about this fight is so fucking bad. Oh, going back to town, reset my poison? Trash. Actual Garbo. Fuck, dude, I almost died just going for the loot. It's fucking such a bad fight. Can I give you all of my love? Mm, suck it, innocence. Mm, I, hate I hate that boss fight so much. Every character I make, I just dread that fight. I don't smoke mine randomly has delays and it very much bothers me. Like I don't think this is gonna fly. Like flame dash doesn't have that. Regular dash doesn't have that. Even whirling blades doesn't have it, and that's an insult. Like if whirling blades does anything better, like that's insulting. Well that's by rail. thing whirling blades should ever be better at is being bad and ruining getting you killed it's a bad positioning that's what it's good at oh my god oh, I just waste so much there we go might do actually we might ditch malevolence as good as it is and do this flesh and stone that we've been meaning to rock right and then um let's we'll do that or despair i feel like despair might be giving me more more damage over time oh skill effect duration maybe not actually 35, 25, mm. 
If we do this, we got ass tons of mana, but that's kind of cheeky. Hmm. I feel like it's so good. Ooh, Chouse, look at that. Switch for three seconds, we get Chouse orbs. Because if I do this, I can go get Flame Dash, which is obviously just the best skill in the game. Or even regular Dash with Swift, uh, Second Wind, which wouldn't be so bad, considering I won't have, like, shit for it. I will have some in. We can Flame Dash. Um... So, mm. Mm. So let's think here, let's think here. We did this and this. Wait, we just need two. I mean, we need those, yeah, but we don't need either of these. Oh, how does that affect Plague Bearer? That doesn't make sense. 40, 32, 12, 38. It doesn't, it just increases the mana cost for literally no reason. That's stupid. Shit design. Um, second wind. Dash. Can Withering Step benefit from that? I don't think it can. Bear Trap probably can though. No. This is the cooldown. It doesn't even have a cooldown. What cooldown is it reducing? Wait, like, uh, the activation cooldown? Really? The activation cooldown? Cooldown time, 0.5 seconds. Oh my fucking god. Okay. Okay, GGG. Sure. Fucking idiots. Um, bear trap. Go over here. Yes, yeah, so that's probably the same thing for Withering Step. Cooldown. Oh, well, wait. Withering Step actually has cooldown. That actually wouldn't be so bad. 2.78. Well, because it's such a small amount. Um, we might want to wither, but I think we actually want it on Bear Trap so we can just unload. But then we just got to make Bear Trap not Bear Trap. We just need to make it something good instead. Like if I, can, if I can get flamethrower trap, um, and then do my cull. Do I have cull on there? Wait, am I scuffed? Hey, wait, we're scuffed. We're scuffed. Hold on, we're scuffed. Where's my cull? Right, we couldn't afford cull because it was like an alt orb. That's what happened. Um, so now that I'm like figuring out my links and shit, also we'll go back. Um, so now that I'm figuring out my link links and shit. I won't call. I need to actually like get desituated. And I would like a I would like flamethrower trap back. I want rage, right? Yeah, no, maybe no. Eh, well, uh, no, eh, no. Um, yeah, what's crazy too is according to PLB, Melee Fizz is like my next strongest link. And like currently I would just swap it out with a, like Melee Splash for a boss or something. Because it does ailments. Um. Fire Trap. I don't think dots count though. That's the problem. So I need flamethrower trap. I made like such a good. God damn it. 
back to the other tune. I really need to just do layup on that guy. If he's really like starts flowing and looking good, we're just gonna do layup on him. I mean library. Keep meaning to grab Alks and I grab Regals, whatever. Okay, so we're gonna do flamethrower trap with the call. Holy flame totem, I wish. length right we need these linked um this shouldn't really be linked with anything else though we need these linked and we need um i wonder if this can do like increased duration and would it affect withered like that's an interesting thought um for now we'll just not worry because we don't have enough sockets these are whatever this can go anywhere that's just gonna stay as is. Malevolence we're benching for now. Although I don't know if it's malevolence or despair is gonna be better. Minus 23% chaos res. I feel like adds chaos damage to hits against cursed enemies. Yeah, that's too much. Too much good. Increased damage from damage over time effects. Yeah, despair is way too much good. Um the malevolence is amazing, but right now I'm having like mana issues and I think we're just going to leave it as is temporarily. So if we do that, um, this is, I don't know why that's even anywhere. And then this doesn't need to exist to actually phase that out. So it leaves my four link, these guys, and this I do want somewhere just hanging out. So I just can't have four links on involving this but i can do probably calling strike with the trap right um now these two so okay that puts a wither step on link to anything which is good I just need this to be blue and green, really. And then we'd be good. Just give me blue and green anywhere in here. Done. Boom. Boom. Plague Bearer. Now, I'm curious if I can get anything else on Plague Bearer. Like, intensify, maybe? To make it just even better. Empower and increase the AOE. Uh, not modify the damage, that's fine. When we increase the debuff, so like wither. I see. That was I see. I see is an intent. Increased cast? No, that's FC. What was I see? Wait. Oh, this is something else. You won't get jealous. You know that I run it. Everything you want to do, I already did. Oh, more fall. Yeah, this is nothing to do with anything. Arcane Surge works with it, not the damage multiplier, enhance, increases the AoE. Oh, that's cool. Um, if you put any corrupts, curse, place one OE, AoE, and corrupt. Oh, that's cool. I'm um, not a lot for it. Okay. So it's pretty much fine, unless I want to slap intensify on it or something. So this is pretty good. Um. I guess pretty good, like, for what it is. Now we do need this somewhere. Does that affect it? It does. Oh! Uh, 
Ink AoE on Flesh and Stone is actually good. Like, can I get Maim too? Um, although I never switch stances. Yeah, I never switch stances. But if I did, that would actually be a cool play. Hmm. Take twelve percent increase. Yeah, that's increased. It's not like a more multiplayer or anything insane. We won't even know it's there. So that's fine. But cool thoughts. Um, now we need to just travel across this way and get up there. Even though we're ultimately going to be going up here, um, we might also be coming down there anyway. So yeah. Yeah, we'll just go through here. We just really want to get to this as fast as possible. And we'll deal with a lot of other routes. Um, cool. Okay, I've actually got to um, hit the little boys room for like two minutes. I'll be right back. Going suspiciously far left for a poison build. Listen, this is gonna be a tank build. Very different. Very, very different. We're gonna be invincible. Um, part of the thing I'm worried about 
is I'm pretty sure I'm the wrong ascendancy. Because I thought Pathfinder was going to be good. And then I found out it wasn't. So that's a concern. Um, I have like a scuffed assassin that I still might switch to. It's like the same level right now. It's one I keep switching to to like get gems and shit. But um, oh that's too funny. Here we go. But um, so here's my concern. My concern is that my entire ascendancy tree is pretty much offensive. I was bent, the only reason I went Pathfinder is because I thought that like poison spread thing was gonna be great. I also thought it functioned completely differently than it does. Now that I found out it doesn't work like that, I'm like really wondering if it's worth it at all. Cause I pretty much have to do melee splash on this to get any type of decent, like respectable clear in between my plague bear windows. So what we end up with is a ascendancy that's almost only there for the 10% fizzes extra poison and the 40% um, chance for poisons to do double damage during flask effect. Which is good, except I'm probably, I don't know if I'm going to have enough crit. The way that the tree is like super, like part of the reason it's so fucking ugly is that we're going to be near the crit, the sword crit node at the bottom. And potentially some sword crit nodes on the right that we just completely avoided. And then hopefully those would be like late game once we're thick enough and we feel beefy. Not late game, but later on we can use those as like a damage gap filler. Like get more like for now just try surviving and then later we can get more damage kind of thing. So like we're in position to get damn, we're just not doing it. And we also passed right over like a huge poison node. We're just trying to not get that stuff till later. Um, and there's mainly the whole reason we're going so far left too that's really like probably not worth it like I really should rethink it but there's the life leech attack nodes that I really want I actually wanted to try and get like some good leech going which I'm second guessing um if there was another option there was like an option C on the table of just going slayer and having nothing to do with chaos or poison in my ascendancy and just doing it anyway. But that one seems kind of scuffed late game, but like it would be super tanky. But it would be like super sketch. I don't know. We're pretty much doing like scuffed things no matter how I spin it. But like I didn't see this fucking plague bringer thing coming at all.
Um, yeah. So I'm really unsure. I just really don't... Like, I even thought about re and Raider. It's like this... Like, uh, the Verulans, if Herald of Agony wasn't banned, which is fucking retarded, Verulans would have actually been really good. Like, that actually would have been really good. And this whole flask effect thing, like with the double damage, like that's also really good. But... I, I, f I feel like this is not a play like I feel like I'm just I'm just not I'm not I'm not feeling good about this character and like the tree is actually the lead like I feel like the tree would work out um, because even like this scuffed route at least I got like this giant cluster that thing that was a hundred percent worth it without for ruins yeah so like it's worth it but is it worth being pathfinder for that's my concern like I know that 40% damage thing is insane I know 10% of fizz's extra chaos is great um, and then 10% more kit. Like, I know it's good, it's just like, is it worth being Pathfinder for literally just this? Because, like, no one cares about Agony Crawlers. I know that, but still. For the Flash Group. Yeah, but then, like, like, which Flash Group? Because for this Flash Group, I have to crit. Like, I'm not. <sighs> Way later, I guess I was gonna crit a bit, and then that would be nice. And if I go this one, that's just. That's nice too, but then I have to figure out like a one point. It would be like this and this. Which would be, I don't know. Because I can't do this. So it's either I go this and this, or I go this and this. And I have to crit. I just don't think in SSF HC, on like this scuffed ass private league with a bunch of trappers on it. Because um, this is a shit league. Like the no rares and blues and the. 40% monster life like this league itself is shit. This is just a slow paced SSF So like if I'm doing that, I just don't see how I can really Benefit flasks off pit. So I I could be very wrong But I just can't think of flasks that are good enough to make Pathfinder itself worth it Especially not when I have an assassin At almost the exact same level sitting there ready to go and he's already got this passive because I assumed I was gonna go um, Viper Strike on him. At, like, at the he was a trapper. He leveled the trapper. And at the last minute, he went here. But he was also a scuffed trapper. Because he got Agnostic Mind Over Matter at, like, level 30. So, he, I kind of scuffed that guy. And then I started refunding all of it. But I think I just need to go back to him, honestly. Because, like, even with the build I'm doing, which I do actually like, like, um... The whole Plague Bearer thing, I had no idea how good that was. That's actually fun as shit. I'm actually very much enjoying that. So, like, if I did that, right, like, I could have, like, this, which, um, this would just let me not need Lesser Poison, which would actually be really big, because then I could do Melee Fizz. It would be, like, a lot of red gems, which would be weird, but my tree's going through a lot of strength anyway, um, although I'd have to... His whole tree, like, needs to change, which is rough, but might be doable. Um, and then, like, like, this is amazing, too. But, everything's good with him. Like, um, opportunistic. I mean, we're not gonna go power charges, but, like, Mistwalker is fucking elusive is amazing. Elusive is always amazing. I mean, and I would just need to get some crit going. Like, that would be the only awkward thing, is that for him, I do want to get crit. But it's just the way his tree starts. Like, he's... Hold on, let me do this. Scuffed. This is his tree, right? This is his hilariously... What the fuck is his name? Sabo Trash League. That's his name. Right, he has no skills on. Um, this, <laughs> so, so this is his tree currently because I had MOM and Agno and I started doing ZDPS because I was trapping and then <laughs> you actually 
<laughs> he was, for the record, actually play the game in a different way. Um, so, I've done softcore trade league for not every single league, but since before Val, like before the first league, like before they had leagues. I've played the game on softcore trade league. And like, I've, I've missed plenty of leagues. I'm not saying I've been around since they won't like, but I've missed, but I've, for a long time, I've always done that. This is, this league heist, I cannot get over, no matter how much I try putting into it, how fucking depressing it is, and how like, much it sucks. So I've just been doing all kinds of stupid shit on <laughs> on SSFHC that I've never played either of those two things before and I was I started having fun and it's like adding a we it's like playing a different game like I'm literally playing a different game that I've been playing for years just until they fix it which is not going to be until next league um so like like this thing it was this it was this and it was hilarious like he was actually kind of beefy but really fucking scuffed <laughs> and like like, it was funny. I just really like Agnostic MOM. Um, so this all needs to obviously be refunded. And I ran out of point refunds. But, like, I redid this to be... I started respecting it would be Viper Strike, and I was right about to get this. Um, but then I just made him Pathfinder. Like, I just said, you know what, fuck it, let me just reroll Pathfinder. But the whole reason I did that was because of that poison thing. I thought that was going to be, like, a fucking, like... Like, not like an Athenos pop, but like, a Beano's. Like, I thought it was going to be a different game. Like, this sucked compared to what I thought it would do. Like, I get what it does now, but like, they need to fucking word that better. Because that was not what I wanted. Um, so I'm pretty much over this fucking character. Like, the only way I think I'm going to enjoy this is if I go Raider. Which, in all fairness, is actually an option. I really like Raider, and I really like Raider for for heists. The problem is, I really like going av like the two av or veiling I, these two. I like doing these two, but I'm not doing elemental damage, so that's pointless. So I'm pretty much forced to do like these, and then this one I don't like. Um, this guy died too, that was really sad. I just did that and he died on Kitaba. That was the guy who got like two shot. But he was also using a different skill. So if I do this, this is probably the smart play and I just gotta figure out how to get my crit fixed. Like, let me just assume that I get all my skill points back. And I like... Actually like... Don't do MOM like a pleb. I get a new crit. Like, this whole tree is so fucking scuffed, though. <sighs> so fucking scuffed. I could just not do those. It's getting the life that I'm worried about. And, like, this path was so good. The thing is, like, if I get, like, every single life node in this area, just for argument's sake. Well, these don't count towards the percent life. I mean, that does, but. The thing is, we gotta get here. I don't think that's worth it with poisons, actually. But, like, there's a huge multiplier here. I'm gonna clean up the tree in a second. I just like kinda. Um. I could even just sacrifice those points and just act like it's a big dex node. And then get. Like, I can just fucking do the same thing that I was doing. Just starting Assassin. Like, just ultimately refund up here. And like, well, no, this is too good. I, there's no reason to refund up there. I just wouldn't be able to get all the way over here as much as I wanted without like scuffing everything. But I could, you know, abort all this. And... 
just get, have something Either way, that's two points. Like, this is like, getting these is so, I feel like that's toxic. So like, that might be the life that we needed to, is this necessary? No. Then we can get these, then we can even get these things. Which, this is huge. Was it this one? Yeah, this is the one that's huge. This is even here. For attack speed and swag. And like, that, between this, these, and my ascendancy itself, that should technically be everything I need for poison damage. I can put the rest in like trying to not die. And I don't think I want Fakro because I want my shield. And Fakro has let me down every single fucking time I've tried it so far. Um, I can ultimately just like path this way too. I could try the leech that I wanted, but I don't think the leech really works with this. Um, what would probably be better would be like this. Although that's that's kind of messy too. Where are we at? 57. Because then we could do this. Then we could do this. And then this. And then like where are we at? 70. We can just fill in this fucking wheel. Let's go like GG. How much life? Please give me a good number. 204%. Huge evasion. I, I just made up a word. <laughs> yeah, like that's actually not the worst tree I've ever seen. <laughs> that's, that's all I'm gonna say for it. It's just not the worst tree I've ever seen. <laughs> um... Phasing on kill, that's chill, that's just not. What's that face? What is that face? Dang, what the fuck? What do you mean, what the fuck? This is definitely not the worst trick you've ever seen. If you think about it, we've got like multiple. These are huge, right? These are huge damage, especially that one. This is huge. So we've got three huge damage boosts. We've got 200 fucking bajillion percent life from tree. We've got insane evasion rating, so we're just gonna go armor evasion on every piece of armor. Um, we have no bonus armor, which is kind of sad, but we have the tiniest bit of life leech, which is super not good, but I don't really know how else we're supposed to get life. Like, I'm actually very confused at how poison builds get life. Does anyone know how poison builds get life? Like, we're gonna have Mistwalker. Oh, we don't need. We don't have crit. We're probably gonna need more crit. Well, we can, like, kind of iron that out. Oh, yeah, the, the sword node. And we'll go swords. Actually, the play might be daggers. How much crit chance? 20. Um, 20, 20, 50. So that's like 110. Um, oh, that's generic. Whatever, let's fill it in, why not? Versus... We do like crit? Claw would be big too. 18, 18, 18, 40. So I get more with swords. Um, daggers probably gets... I might close. There's something else here for it. Something around here. There is this. That's a little bit of a hike though. Yeah, because I probably haven't seen your other trees. Okay. Wait. What exactly did I say? I said this is not that... Okay, look. Listen, listen, listen. Don't look at this. Don't look. Don't look at all this. Look at this. Just look at this. Look at this tight. Look at this this area over here on the left, right? Just look at this clean. Don't worry about it up top because I was too lazy to put the skills in. Just look at like from total from increased percent life down. Just look at that. That's fucking good. Like that's not bad. 
Because the wording could be like... <laughs> but no, look, that's not bad. Like, it looks scuffed, but it's actually not bad. Um, only problem is, like, that no that life number is going to have to go down for crit. So... See, claws, I can get these. Problem is, claws are, like, kind of out there. Like, it's a bit of a hike. Um, I mean, these are right here, but that's, like, one, two, three, four. Oh, it also has accuracy rating. Oh, my God, I forgot about accuracy rating. Oh, fuck my ass. I forgot about accuracy rating. That's a thing, though. There's an accuracy rating crit. This is attack speed accuracy. Accuracy crit is actually over there. It's over in Narnia. I could do like attack speed blind. Um, Cause they'll always be, if I'm in sand stance and they're always blinded, this is actually like. Fifty percent crit chance. Uh, 24% damn, 90% crit chance, 24% damn, and another 15% accuracy rating for 4 points. That's not that bad. Um, if I just stay in, stay in sand stance. Well, that's the thing is I'm also sacrificing an aura, but I kind of want to do that anyway because I'm super paranoid about it, everything. Because if, if I'm in sand stance and everything's blinded, not taking Thacker is a lot more justified. Um... Sorry, 67, 20 seconds. Juicy T16 map, yeah. yeah. I would not, oh man. That's, that is, that makes me miss softcore a little. I think swords are gonna be my play. Right, I mean, uh, swords have some insane, you know what, you know what I should look at to like really, Owls. Daggers do have global crit chance, though. And there's that thing that's really cool. The global crit chance, though. Oh, there's different type of daggers? That's fun complicated. So like we're at like 69 to 74. <laughs> yeah, so we'll say about 70 to 75. Well, like 70, 70, 70 to 74. Um the fuck? Oh wow, those are amazing. So these obviously come from heisting. We might need to be claws and then eventually get those. And then just craft on those because they drop white. That's crazy. Isn't that crazy? Am I crazy or is that crazy? And their damage is actually pretty good. Like the DPS. And they're fast. Yeah, some of them are really fast. Um, instead of crit, they got like survivability implicit. The crit implicit is pretty big talk though. Like we can't really sleep on that. Now the swords, which everybody knows, get way fucking high. They just get so much fucking damage. So it'll be between swords. Oh my god, it's between all three. They're all so fucking good. Honestly, I think swords. I think we go swords. And swords will have the most nodes here. And then that's like too much. I think I think I think I think I think 
Okay, I think, okay. I, okay, okay, okay. Ah! <laughs> I think, I think, wait, wait, no, these are, <laughs> wait, give me this back. Wait, these are scuffed. Okay, I think we're literally just gonna like put the gear on him and not even touch it. We're, we're just gonna do this. <laughs> just. <laughs> wait. Wait, look at these plates. They'll never see it coming. We need the off hands too, of course. We gotta keep leveling with fucking Viper Strike. Okay. Okay. Okay, hold on. These are plays. These are. <laughs> Hold on, these are plays. We got this. We, we, look at the- <laughs> Hold on. Where's my tree? Okay. Okay, now this is, this is big plays. Ten more in- oh my god. Where do we get in? Can I switch that part? I didn't actually optimize this tree, there's one point. Yeah, actually, wow, that doesn't even get clean. Okay, um, is there anything huge that we wanted to travel towards? I mean, yeah, but it's not really a rush. We're also, oh my god, this is so fucked. Did want to go down, like straight down here. This is awful. Um, when did we get dam? Yeah, it's all like down here. Unless we cut across and get the poison things up here, just to fucking have some dam. I mean, we don't. We have like no life because of this. Oh Jesus Christ! Oh Jesus Christ! I'm just Jesus Christ. What am I even doing? Okay, you know what? It's gonna work. Watch. Watch me just walk into a zone and get one shot. <laughs> and that's it, it's over. <laughs> it's a very. That could very much happen. Ah! Okay. Um. Cory's level 44. Mm. So I can go get a melee splash. Lesser poison, I think I have one here. Yes. Um, so I can go get melee splash. And then. It's level 40 dash. And second one. <laughs> Two billion XP per hour. What, you or me? <laughs> <laughs> I know my XP per hour is pretty impressive, okay? But listen. Two billion's a lot. Like, that's insane. That's just mapping. That's crazy. Super awkward, but are, are either of these not like level four? No. Nope. 
about it like I do Isn't me and your mom when you were someone new Trying to map out in my head How we got here from where we started Take a leave, I should have gone Got stuck trying to write your wrongs mm. No 42 flex, feel bad. Two fucking billion, oh my god. Oh my lanta. Can you sell everything over here on the right? Um Okay, okay, check it. I think we're good. We just need to buy all of these gems. <laughs> Not these. These will catch up on their own. But we need to just buy everything in here with this many alts. <laughs> Does anyone have? They would have a mangery so I could split my alteration arms. <laughs> I'm running low. <laughs> um, ethical. I am so ethical. Oh look, someone else died. Good, good, yes. I really need everyone else on the ladder to die three more times. Every hour. And I still won't catch up. <laughs> Um, oh my dear. Okay. So now that this is clean though, let me, let me take it. Let's, let's be serious. I need Ink AoE. I need Plague Bear. I definitely need Plague Air. That. I definitely need that. I really need these. Um, these are optional. These are really not optional. So if I could bring them down like... I think I have a few scours, not really enough, but if I could bring any of these down like one and then use it, that would be worth. Alright, like that that would be a huge help because it's actually gonna be impossible to buy. But yeah, look at that. No. If I have a regret, I'm pretty sure I used them all, yeah. So this we'll probably have to buy, right? Um Call strike we're really not that worried about yet. It's like so early. Um Plague Bearer we are, but that's one point. Awesome. And then what about this ink AoE we'd like to buy if possible. Um control trap. Melee splash. Hmm. And these we don't really care too much about. Okay, so let's try see what we can buy here out of this list. Um Haley Splash is Act 1. Let's go check that out. Oh my god, my guy looks Oh my god, look at this scuffed character. Oh. They called him Francois. <laughs> Dang. Oh, it's up, okay. Keith. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> okay. Do I have four? Yeah, I got four to five. That's like my number one important thing. Okay. I really need a real chest. Why am I still using this? It's a legend in the making, exactly. This dude 
This guy's going places. We're not gonna talk about where those places are, but he's going places. Oh, we can get dish. Nice. Oh, flame dish? No, we want swag dish. But second wind, I don't know where we get. Um, I think I always have to buy it from like... Yeah, from some from the thing with the thing. Where is that? Oh god, is that in the chest? It was. So I just need these two greens to wait? You know what, I can just do this. Could say he's going in deep. Oh, he's, <laughs> he's he's gonna try. Look, look now. There's a fancy piece of armor on. <laughs> what a baller! Now it all comes together. His entire ensemble has now been <laughs> accomplished. Um. Okay. Let's see. So I need. One chance we can do that. Ah, son of a. Wait. Wait, that's conk. Where's the good one? Oh, you know what? It doesn't have it yet. How the fuck does he have it? Is this guy a magician? No, you know what? He could actually buy it from the vendor. I bet you, yeah, he buys it from the vendor. It's just in, it's in Act 5, 4, 4. So that's not there. So we can check that. But this is just a chance orb, and then we need second win. Whoops. Another chance orb. That's fine. We'll just bring all the fucking chance orbs. Splash we already got, so that's fine. Um, what about we got dash too? So we just need... If we can get cull, that would be great. With one alt. Ooh, they get you on the alts. Okay, this guy's almost ready to actually play. A lot of very serious prep work. This guy, he's he's years ahead of his time, really, is what's going on here. Defensive layers. He's got. He's got defensive. He's got <laughs> offense. Just <laughs> why is he slower? <laughs> why is this guy slower than the raider? Oh, right. This dude's passive tree is wasting literally half of his tree. Right. No big deal. Oh Jesus Christ! I don't know how I'm gonna fix that. Um. Okay. Finish my friend's homework. What did I miss? Um. Oh God. <laughs> The Pathfinder Ascendancy doesn't work out the way I thought it does. So now, wait, what the fuck? This is the Pathfinder. So now we went back to our assassin, and he had already had an identity crisis on his lab. So at the last second, he switched to be this. I was gonna do Viper Strike anyway, but his skill tree. I only had so many refunds and regrets to get out of MOM. So he's still half agnostic, and he still has the wrong path. So, Pathfinder's final. No, fuck that. We don't like the Pathfinder. That Ascendancy did not do what we were told. We want our money back. So, <laughs> we're gonna do Assassin. We're gonna get Mist Walker. And he's gonna be a thick son of a bitch. And it's gonna be great. And he's gonna crit. But his passive tree is currently very scuffed. Um, so, that's a thing. That we're uh, just that you know I need a lot of refund points but in the meantime um we're fixing things get the blast we get the second wind 
Right, so the only other thing would be like cull, and we gotta buy this from a vendor. And technically withering stuff, but we're not really too worried about withering stuff. Cost of trans, that's rough. Cull we should just buy from Act 2, actually. Withering step was Act 1. I can sell you regretos if you need. No, 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 no. I appreciate it, but, but actually, wait, maybe I do. <laughs> um, well, let me, let me see how scuffed this is first. Mother of... Wait, what's up? Flames over trap. Oh, I got these in the wrong. Right, that goes. Cold goes there. Don't delete Facebook or you will lose all Oculus games for good. What? Were they like linked to a Facebook account? And it's just like, poof. Dude, that sounds scuffed. Like, are, is that is that working as intended? That sounds fucking scuffed. I have no idea, dude. That sounds scuffed. All right, here we go. We got everything ready to go. So our passive tree is completely fucking scuffed. However, however, oh, he's fucking jewel socket. Shit. It's just what your news ticker has been trying to tell me. It doesn't really. <laughs> this is valuable information, though. But this is valuable information. I don't think I have a place for this though. I mean, one reform point left, use it fucking wisely. Oh, I should have refunded Agnostic. Oh well, we'll get there. Wait, does that actually have 40? Yeah, yeah, 10, 20, 30, yeah, yeah, okay. Wait. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. We haven't killed an Alch- Oh! I don't know if this guy's ready. I don't know if this guy's ready. Wait, oh my god. I don't even want to put the MTX on him on- Oh my god. Until we're sure that, like, he actually does anything right. Which, like, I don't know if- If, if we'll ever be sure of that. Alright, ready? Here we go. Clap! Clap! Oh my god, he's so slow. Why am I- why am I- Oh, I forgot to put on Incubate. Yeah, get fucked. Dude, this guy is so slow. What the fuck is this? Oh my god. It's all of those shield nodes down south, that's why. He's got like... Oh, the Pathfinder's tree is so much better. Oh my god, and he's still got Agnostic. That's comically scuffed. Or genius! No, it's scuffed. Dude, this guy can't... He can't put... Dude, just whiff central. <laughs> I still haven't maxed out Plague Bear. <laughs> but he's so tanky because of Agno, but he's out of mana. Wait. Wait. <laughs> I'm so good, I hope not. Maybe. It's high level suffering. Yo. I'm just gonna use. 
I'm just gonna use TPs. I run out of mana. Look at this, look at this. Invincible. Look at this. As long as I have mana flasks, invincible. Actually invincible. Oh wait, we're out of mana flasks. You know what? We're gonna we're gonna try some we're gonna go for it. Going for the gold. Come on, come on. I have no mana regen. Oh, because I keep losing health. <laughs> this guy needs an orb of regret. Um, wait. I can get them from the vendor for, like, my firstborn child or something. Here we go. Okay, at the very least, this needs to happen. Okay. <laughs> oh, dear. This will be easy. It's my absolute cakewalk. <laughs> Felt a lot better with the with the nodes that I don't have. Thing is, this is not gonna work for the boss. I mean, it'll work for this guy because I have Plague Bearer, but then, like, once that runs out, like, we're scuffed. Wait, hold still. Hold still. Master, what, do you really think the Pathfinder is like for SSF HC? I just I don't get how she can survive. Like how? Because you've obviously done a lot more of these than I have. Like a lot more. Like, do you have like a pro tip on how I could not feel like my Pathfinder is gonna get two shot? 100% flask up time. But don't you need crit for that? Like, even with the... With the ailment immunity, that's elemental. Like, like, I... Because, like, the Pathfinder... So, like, that's what I don't get, right? So... So, like, this... BV poison build. Really? So, like... So you took like this and this, like you actually took Master Alchemist as a chaos build with no elements at all. Like you weren't doing free shock, you know, none of that. And you still took Master Al Alchemist just for the... I mean, yeah, you guys aren't wrong, but still, damn, I, I really, <laughs> I just, I really underestimated it, like, I just really didn't think it was that, like, I didn't think it was that, 
fuck it. Honestly, this Pathfinder was actually doing good. I just felt like uncomfortable about it. Like she was actually fucking. Um. Like, I know her flasks are scuffed and shit, but that's, like, work in progress type thing. Um. <laughs> Wait, reflexes flask? Oh, of reflexes. Oh, I see what you mean, since we're not going for freeze or any of that we can get like 98% armor and evasion rating and all that shit. Okay, you can try to talk about Coralitos. Shock beyond one shot in the park. No, okay Deadly, wait, Deadly, hold on. That oh I see what you're saying. That wouldn't happen because he wouldn't have been shocked. It would have still hurt like shit but I wouldn't have died. That with the assassin? I literally took all the pieces off and just put them back to the path. <laughs> like as soon as as soon as I was like, I don't get it, is this worth doing it without the elemental? You go, yep, I just took everything off. Yeah, I just I always felt like that wouldn't be as good as the crit one. And I know I wasn't doing the crit one, but I mean uh. Oh wow, really? I didn't actually know that. It's like on the tree. Isn't it only like mana though? These are mana. Oh wait, no. Oh, these are just flash charges gained. Oh. Hmm. Let's get right here. Mana might be a little rough, but I could use that to get like precision or I don't know, fucking something like that. Huh. Because I, I feel a lot better about the tree down here than I do about up here. But, like, the only option I have for poison in terms of, like, these ascendancies are Slayer. Like, that's, like, it. So, like... Hmm. So, Pathfinder is the closest thing to it. Because, like, I want to use a shield. I don't know, Assassin is great, no doubt. But I should prefer to play a slip and PF. Right, like, that's, I mean... That was part of what I wanted, I just couldn't really figure out how the flare stuff would be worth it, but I guess I just gotta roll them. Like, for the- I mean, that makes sense. That makes sense. Those are really big if you roll them like that. Alright, um... Oh, I have two passive points, speaking of. I might get that then. Well, I don't have that yet. That's not a rush. Um... Where was I going? Like... Oh, right, this I was going over, because I really wanted this leech because of the attack speed and the fact that it was leech. And with my with the way that Viper Strike works and the chaos and everything, um, which means the maps, not so much while leveling, I think. Yeah, yeah, like, that probably would have been the first thing I go, like, I would get these, obviously, first, that's what I wanted. Um, but yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, I did want that, and it's not really wasted. There's only like one, two, three. Ugh, it's four wasted for travel, but I could also get the armor and the all res. And then it's only one more, two. Well, I guess two more for that. And I get this whole life cluster. Like this is actually a pretty good section to go as long as I want stuff on the way to justify it, like this. And this, like, you want, yeah. You can even transition this to the scion, but that's, I don't know, I wouldn't, I would start running out. I do want to get poison stuff like this guy over here. And 
All right. Um. All right. All right. Uh, I, I feel. I feel a little better about it. Let me. Let me go back to punching something. Let me go punch something. I made tortellini with creamy sauce. Oh my god, that sounds good. Oh my god, that sounds good. Grants attacking care speed to travel skills. Wait, that's stupid. Alright, whatever. Um. Oops. Gate of Chaos was actually kind of big, so I'm gonna keep that. Bleeding. When you deal a crit, fuck it. It's bleeding. Um. Scoffed ass fucking pages. one I made. Yeah, the only other thing would be like this guy. That's crit that wouldn't matter. Yeah, so we're pretty much cars level 40. Oh, I forgot about this. Oops. 1.6k, 1.6. So it's the tiniest bit more. Like the same speed and everything, I was like, no. It's like so irrelevant. Um. Oh, these are like the same item. I'm gonna keep using this one because fucking. It's been doing me right. Okay, so I gotta sell all this shit. Um, we're gonna keep that there. We're gonna put all these back. We're gonna. Vendor like all of those except maybe the manas. These are level 42. I lied with vendoring all of this. And then. Oh, uh, fuck it. I don't want to keep this though. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, I made a flask. Look at that. Foreboding of steadiness. Stun and block recovery. Oh my god, that's a thing. Well, foreboding, um, eh, mm, 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 mm. Alright, where the fuck am I? We're gonna find a Tulu. Vendor is a big <laughs> Totally, yeah, totally did that on purpose. I knew exactly what was gonna happen when I sold those, okay? Oh shit, wait, wrong, wrong aura. Here we go, here we go. Who the fuck did my buttons? Oh yeah, yeah, fucking get cut, get cut, okay, okay, we're cook we're we're cooking again. Okay.
Wait a minute. I already did this, didn't I? Yeah. Oh, sign of purity. They want me to do the ossuary. I don't want to do no ossuary. They don't know me. They don't know my struggles. Okay, so... Damn, I should have just taken the waypoint. Let's just go. Where is Utulu? I demand to speak with your Utulu. What is my hit chance? 96. I mean, well, we could definitely get precision involved. Which we should, actually. I think it's like act one. Yeah, that's act one. Note to self. Get precision. Like, no reason not to with this extra mana. Um, wait. It's not here. Is it here? Nope. And that's a dead end, too, it looks like. So it's gotta be here. Oh, are we maxed? Oh, yeah, we are. What's up? Like fucking dash is letting me down right now. I fucking hate finding two. There's no reason this map should have this many dead ends. Like backtracking is not fucking enjoyable, and Poe has so much of it. Yeah, this part right here, the fucking plague bearer, like this thing is nuts. Like honestly crazy. The fuck is shooting me, go away. Ethical blade vortex. Like, <clears throat> it seems so crazy. Like, that's gonna be so good for heisting too. Oh my god. And I'm fucking with that chest. No need. Fucking zone sucks. There's like five mobs scattered out. Like, okay, this is a much better clump, but like, it's still shit. No movement speed. I have 15%. Should be fucking 
playing like Zeus the God of Thunder right now. Sign of purity. Okay, we're gonna fight Katava. On the way to him, we're gonna get played bear stacks. We're gonna fucking send it. It's gonna be juicy. Did you look into installing the Twitch PBR extension? I did not want to further encourage our vaccinating. Um, that's a funny way of wording. No, yeah, I actually, uh, I hit the button. I think I, I think I have it. I just need to like add it because it's like I gotta add it to the scene. Um, let me actually clap this. Let me get up to Katava real quick and then I'll turn it on. Like before I do the fight. So the fight's gonna take me like five years, so. It looked like, um, no it's not Nobius, it's Streamlabs. In Streamlabs, like I've looked through like, uh, yeah, they had it in, in Streamlabs. It was like built in. It was like they had a whole thing. They were like, oh, you should install this. This is really cool because you play that game. And I was like, oh, yeah, I probably should. And I just didn't really like mess with it. Um, the part you're talking about, I already did. But the, uh, get on top of the stream. Oh, you're not talking. I think we're talking about different things. Because yeah, the one I'm talking about is like it shows it on the scene. And I was like, I, that seems like not like it seems like it would eat up most of the screen wait that should be on then yeah activate oh set as overlay one Every time you set your streams category to Path of Exile. Oh, it was installed, but it wasn't activated. I don't, I don't know where it goes. It should be there now, though, whatever that means. Maybe if I just refresh. Oh, look at that! Visible, yes. Add to my channel? I did. Didn't I? Oh, wait a minute. I think I totally misunderstood what this is. Do you see it now if you refresh? How does it know me? Oh, configure. No problems found. <laughs> Active character, member pathfinder. It says it knows me. Is it there? It should be there. Oh shit. Fight started. I'm doing like ZDPS, but Plague Bear is going to be sick <laughs> once it's stacked up. 
works. Nice, sweet. I do want to see what it looks like. I just need to. I don't want to click it right now. I've scuffed enough. You know. I hate this. I feel like I'm always just waiting forever for this part. Oops, totally blinked out of that. Mmm. Scuffed. This guy is not taking damn. Like, this feels awful. <sighs> I don't think Slam can kill you through one uh, Apparently not. I mean, he's hit me with, like, damn near everything so far. I like at least once. Not every, you know. I mean, it's like, there's definitely a good reason I'm doing no fucking damage, I'll tell you that much. I've pretty much been like using, pretty much been letting like Plague Barrier, or Plague Bearer, like carry my damage for me while I. That and like the melee splash has been good too, but like while I just build defensive. And like I don't mind like a once in a while while I'm leveling like long boss fight. If the rest of it's like still plenty quick. Like most of the killing was actually pretty good considering it's fucking Viper Strike. Ah, that was bad. Stop punching me, dude! Are we full yet? Where are we at? Oh shit, he like juked me. Fucking professional, this guy. I also like the ore I'm using, like the flesh and stone thing. It's like kind of scuffed, but honestly, like, he's straight up been missing attacks. Like, that should have hit me just because of that. It's so, like, so defensive heavy. Ah. Oh my god, can you fucking... You dead yet? Um, yeah, it's all thirty base. Yeah, so like, um, yeah, so literally none of my gear got upgraded this entire act. Like, I literally went through this entire act with the same gear I had from uh, the previous one. So like, that's why it looks so shit. It's literally an entire act behind. This was just sitting in my stash and it's absolute dog shit. It was just better than the brisk crap I had on. Like, like uh, it's it's definitely bad gear. The thing is, like, I didn't notice it because with Plague Bear, like, Plague Bear was actually just kind of clearing stuff for me. So I didn't realize how behind my gear got 
until that boss fight where I realized like, oh shit, wait a minute, I'm doing absolutely no damage. <laughs> um, so that's a thing. That and my passive tree is also kind of awk because in like one, two, three, four, in five levels I'll have like a huge attack speed buff. Um, and then after that it's like life and yeah. Yeah, no shame to it is pretty impressive because it's four percent life and the gear. Well, that well that I appreciate because I am like considering like I'm using a shield, right? Like I'm not gonna be, you know, doing any crazy dual wield bullshit. And like like there's this stuff is damage. This is damage. Um, this is damage. Like, it, I mean, uh, not really. <laughs> it would be this, but I didn't take it. This is damage. And like, eventually there's still gonna be, you know, like, potentially over here, depending on what we need and don't need. Um, definitely this, which is two fucking points. I should really just get this out of the way, just cause it's two fucking points. And this is like one of the biggest damage things for poison for some, for whatever reason, of meh. Um, like, this will be there, like, we got, or we can, like, just get that, skip this, get these for swords, like, we, we got, we got all kinds of damage potential. We've just been fucking holding off on it. Um, but I definitely need to upgrade the weapon, like, that's, that's, if nothing else, that's definitely, like, the play. 22% attack speed, Jesus. So, like, Required level 44? Oh my god. And it's got accuracy rating, which I've been slacking on. That might even be a play too. I just like use like accuracy swords for a little bit and let that like carry me not getting accuracy. So I can like just fucking act like I forgot. Be like, oh no, I forgot accuracy rating, selling me. These are 46. How far am I away from 46? That's the real question. One level. I'm like four bars. If I could just sit out for a little longer, I'll just probably end up doing. Wait, 21 to 49. They're just really fast. Th this guy kind of fucks. We'll do this guy. We're gonna make a thick boy ultra sword right now. This sword. They will. They will tell stories of the sword I'm about to make for years to come. Like, this will be, like, around the campfire. They will describe this sword in great detail. Okay, here we go. Ready? Watch me not have the currency to make it good. 48. I'm not 40. Oh no. Fuck. Oops. I like scuffed my chair. Okay. Fuck. So we don't actually have the currency to make it good yet. But, I mean, the level. If I had eight alts, easy claps, dude, like, just a few levels, yeah, that's what I'm saying, like, that's insane, but that's like, f that's three levels with this scuff sword, yeah, I mean, I, ugh, yeah, might as well, because this is like, that actually came out way better than we thought, just gonna do it, so at 48, we get this super fast fucking, oh my god, 30% increased damage of poison. What the fuck? I gotta put this in here so I don't accidentally sell it. Like, I've been scuffing enough that that, that could happen. Um, yo, wait, what if we do some heist? What if we catch up on some heist? That should be good XP. Right? That should probably be. I feel like this 34 might be kind of scuffed. Wait, 44, 40. Maybe not. Are the resist fix? Um, shit, did I? No, wait, what did I just break? When did I fuck up my resist? Oh, from Kitava. Oh, fuck me. 
Oh shit, good call. I'm so fucking all over the place today. Um. Shit. It's because of this. This little fuck's gotta go. I should actually have a good ring somewhere. Um. This one's good because it's <laughs> four suffixes. So I just gotta, I just gotta do boom. No, okay, let me stop this. Let me put a resist. Shit, I don't have one that's too high. Shit, maybe not. Huh! Oh, I tried. Um. Wait, what is this? Is I supposed to use this? That's like nothing. Craft a ruby ring? Nah, dude, why would I craft a ruby? I'll just go get a two stone. Because I need something else, too. Because it's fire and cold, so I'll just go get the fire cold two stone. I just wanted to see if I had something lying around um, to make my life easier. I'll just get the fire cold two stones and then fucking, uh. Um. Oh. Feels bad. There's a way to craft that. That I don't know. Fall off the top of my head. Um. I mean, this bitch will probably have it. One of these guys should have it. Nope. Two stones is more value in general, but fig ruby only needs to get one specific goal. Yeah, but if I take the two stone, my dick will be big. <laughs> That's the part that we're overlooking here. Oh, I thought I could craft that. Shit, maybe I can't. Who's next? Act four. I'm gonna find it. No, now I'm determined I'll find this fucking ring. Gotcha. What did I say? Fire cold? Wait. Okay. Might, uh, may very well be a ruby ring after all. Because then I could just fucking regal it and, like, put on the resist I need. This would have been cooler, though, if it worked. <laughs> this would have been cooler. <laughs> Fuck you, Bestel. Sell me the scuffed ass rings. Um, yeah, why not? Now. Straight up. Ow, shit. Wow. Um. I always do that to me as well, right? They never have the one you're looking for. Not bad, dude, right? That's actually, like, insane. So 54 is not real. Um, 32 is real. I almost just want to put another resist on it. It actually has an open suffix, like. Um. Yeah, I guess we'll just do this 32 life. And boop. RP, okay. That was comical. All the rolls just showed up on me. Is this the GG sword? Yeah, that's fucking sick. There was another one. Is it this one? This one was also super hot. But this doesn't have the poison. That's for 66. Um, okay. Okay. I think. 72. My fire res is actually still under. Fuck. Fuck it. Fuck it. Okay, there we go. Now we're good. Now we're good. I hate having even like 1% because it's like 1% more damage taken. Um, okay. Now. Now we can get to fucking. Now we can get to it. Alright. 
Then do Plague Bearer stuff. It's gonna be sick nasty. It's gonna be freaking hot. It's gonna be sweet. It's gonna be juicy. Juicy. Whatever we're done here. I see a unique and a mystery box. Plague Bear is fucking amazing. I just wish there's like, I need a better way to like monitor it than having to look at the buff, you know what I mean? Oh, a <laughs> unique ruby ring. Kappa. Um. Yeah. That's really. This three will probably be a full, yeah. Um, let me get a little closer. Whoop, go, go. Waiting in ambush. We will get back to that. No safes? No, okay. <laughs> that felt good. That felt really good. Oh shit, okay, let's uh, give them their space. 15k, it's almost there. Okay, pick that thing up. Okay. Hey, yo, Faustus, give me my coin. Aria. Wait, so this is 44. So technically, like, with the way Plague Bear is working, I should be able to get good, um, like XP out of these on the way out. I just like kind of kill until I get a good plague bear and then use it to kill everything.
I get him? I think I got him. I can't fucking tell. Overrated in jail, nice. Hmm. Ran div cards. Oh, precision, right. I forgot I wanted that. Thanks for reminding me, game. Um, oh wait, do I want those cards? Probably. Okay. Blocks attacks. I guess he's like dodging, blocking half of my shit. Okay. <laughs> Squeaked out a level. About 45, yeah, 46. Okay, so we only need two more technically. Um, oh, we're getting so close to our attack speed. Shit. We probably should like detour quick and get the lifes and armors instead of just full sending it into that attack speed area. I think I'm getting them in the wrong order, but. Mm. This 39 will just work the way up. I think this character is very slow. You know what it is? This These movement speed flasks are scuffed. And I just don't have a better one. Because there was like a lack of them dropping. And the character had the good one died. Fuck. Oh well. Fuck. Ugh.
put you want some you want some more? Get out. Um ooh. Okay. Basket raper. Oh damn. He rapes baskets. Random fossil, some orbs. Those, those chests are weird. Uh, okay, there's no more room, so. Wait, is that fire cold? No, that would have been funny. Oh, that would have been comical. Hmm. Meow, incubating. Oh my god, plague berry is so good. Safes, what's up, safe? Yo, you giving them phallus? You giving them phallus? Ooh. We're gonna get fortified, and now we're gonna ooh right through all y'all. Hop, ooh, 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 juicy. Yo, pop that open for my tips. I'll be over here clapping. Well, there's nothing in there. Alright, well, I appreciate you for trying. Oh, shit. Okay, then. Yo, Tibbs just slapped down. He was just like, yo, watch me send it. I was like, alright. And he sent it. Oh, oh, oh. Meow. Like seeing like a group of like non-scary mobs, like just elite, uh, non-elites like that. And just be like, oh, it's time to get fucking Plague Bear stacked. Meow. It's like in a tight group, but it's like a few punches and it's ready to go. Like right there, I let it run for a while, took it off, did one slap, and it was full again. <laughs> what the fuck? Meow. Dude, it's so good. Oh my god. For this league, with like shit just randomly having way more fucking health than it was designed to, being able to pop that fucking play shit is that's really crazy. How much does a little chunk every time? Oh man, kind of miss multi strike though, but like melee, I don't know, fortify. Yeah, we can't really. Hmm. Hmm. Looks like if it's probably stupid, but if I happen to get 40% chance of poison on hit anywhere else, I could. 
drop it for like MS just to get faster bearers, which is like weird, but. This is 15, 25, 35. Actually, yeah. If I just got these two clusters, I wouldn't actually need lesser poison. And I kind of want to get them anyway for Big Dam. Um, I feel like I should actually just scuff this for right now at least, this whole attack speed thing. And just become like a thug and just get like multi-strike. Like if I do these and I drop lesser poison and I get multi-strike. Like uh, that would be really fast or even just faster attacks. Honestly. Um, either one. Just some way to like thug out. Probably faster attacks. Hmm. I don't really want to do too much experimenting though. Because I don't really have a lot of currency for that. But like... I you know what? Like that's a thing. Like that, would, I feel like that would be a good idea. Because if it, if he comes down to most of my damage and shit coming from, um, you know, one source anyway, I might as well monopolize on that one source. But uh, although technically it's based on the damage I do, so if I get my, uh, it's like a different scale. Very interesting, it's a different scale. Cause dot multi. I guess it's calculating the overall poison amount when it hits. So dot multi would probably still increase it. I feel like these weapon ones are kind of not good because nothing can drop rare and it's kind of scuffed. We're gonna keep trying now. This the do you? Oh, you did? Oh, yeah, you did. Is it coming? No? I didn't drop anything. Jesus Louise. Yeah, we've been better off just doing more chests, damn it. And there's a talisman that's also useless in this fucking league. God damn it. Five link staff. Probably worth keeping just because. Plague bearer? Oh my god. 
That's actually so good. Like, I feel like at some point I'm gonna have this character, like, swinging fast enough and doing things so that I can really, like, have fast, quick play bear stuff going on. But for right now, it's kind of scuffed. But I feel like once I get that ironed out, um, like, god damn. You know, daggers and claws are generally, f uh, well, no, there's fast swords. Hmm. Probably just went the wrong way. You know, if it wasn't for Plague Bear, I literally would have quit this character by now. Not even kidding. It's too funny. What's funny too is I wouldn't have even thought to try it. You're just like, yo, you're using Plague Bear, right? And I was like, no, nah, what's that? And you're like, oh, dude, let me change your fucking life. <laughs> it's like, oh, shit, okay. Oh, that's a juicy area back there. Shoom. Literally, it's, I'm gonna call it, it's ethical BV. Ethical blade vortex. <laughs> Finding ethics in a scuffest league. Miracle, where's my wanks? Boom. I'm actually got a couple of Contis, or um, Bloopies, that we were, Holding off on? I think I might do them. I think I might just turn this into like a little send session because I'm already halfway through 46. And then it'll just be like, we're very close to using the hot sword. Which like should really be a fucking double DPS. 196. What's this one? Probably like one, 101. Almost double the DPS and 30% increased damage with poison. 1.4 and it's not. It's technically slower, but not really by much at all, so that's that part's good. Um Probably even better than this thing. What about this alt regals until? No. I mean 48, yeah. Oh yeah, I know. It's like the same sword. Um. Okay, I gotta take a whiz though real quick. I'm gonna be right back for like two minutes. I'm gonna do this blueprint, uh, this contract, and then we're gonna start dipping into blueprints. Um, I get this little 36 out. Well, yeah, the trinkets don't even matter, which is hilariously effing scuffed. Um. Damage with swords and all res. Ooh. Ooh. Mm. Wait, did I? Oh my god, I never put the jewel back on this guy. He's actually been missing something big. Ooh, scuffed. Scuffed. have been missing unholy might no big deal
Oh, baby, baby. doing stuff. There's some hold on, there's 44. Cause I just realized like, I'm not really using these. They're not really doing me justice as like a catch up. If um, If they're the same level as me. So it's an enchanted arm in, so I'm like hoping I get a good five link. So I'm revealing the other room. But I feel like I don't want to get too crazy on investment. Because it's low level. Mm. But mm. Like actually so good though. 3.6k, I've got enough. I can't do both of these. 
I don't think I really care about uniques though. Anymore. Like, I think we're, you know. Let's do the currency. My currency. For 160. Mm, for like 400, I can get the escape routes. It's like one heist. I think I'm gonna do it. I really like the escape routes because they're usually a lot quicker. They're kind of a waste, but I mean. I feel like the currencies are like the money. It's like if you got the money, you don't spend it while you have it, you know? Alrighty. Let's get this gravy train rolling, baby. Got a double corridor grand. Juicy currency too. I want, yeah, you know, let's try another point in precision. Let's get this loop. Look at all these fusings, regrets. Val, GCP, Regals. Oh my god, yes. Oh, juicy, baby, juicy. Let's go over here. Let's do it again. Now we do have enough for the armor room, but I'm pretty sure the armor room is like scuffed. I don't think these armor side areas are really ever like good. Like any of the like big links and shit I've seen are from the actual curios. So well, we can pop a few chests. Yeah, nothing really. Alright. Let's go see what we got. Alright, so it's really a two handed sword. Um physical modifiers but yeah, but that's a two hander. A dagger with fire modifiers. Okay. Lightning modifiers on a knife. Cutlass with has a white socket and speed modifiers. Um this would actually be really good if you know it actually dropped with any of those stats. And a four links, or yeah, four staff. I mean, this sucks. Fucking random ass safes are gonna be better. Oh, it sucks. One of the safes dropped the regret orb. Literally best item in the whole place. Uh, I guess the... I kind of want the speed mod cutlass just because it's got the cool white socket. Oh, look, am I full? Yeah, pretty much.
What's up? Yo, fight me. Mm. Do I even need to go back? Does that speed modifier count as crafted? Like, if I go put fucking attack speed on it, is that actually? Did that just? Did that just accidentally become amazing? Um, my God, wait, what? But what about that one? But like, what the fuck? How did? How did this happen? Oh my dear. Okay. Um, so I'm pretty sure that counts. So I just need to go. Global Fizz is pretty good. Only these are actually not bad. They're not what I'm looking for, though. Okay, to the other room. Which one of these did I do? He was coming from this way. Okay. Well, the currency is good, if nothing else. That's at least nice. Currency out of a random chest. Look at that. Fucking juicy. Juicy. Alright. Yo, tips. Bust this down. We were fucking going for the gold. Don't get these big prizes. We go right in here. It's gonna be a five link chest piece. Now I'm gonna look. I wanna look. Make sure all the enemies are clear. There they are. Check for these safes. Here's one. Here's the other. Alright, what we got? Four link chain mail. No red sockets. So, um. Okay. Speed modifiers and a ritual scepter. Okay. Um. Grove bow. A five link grove bow. Mana mods and reduced attributes. Okay. I mean. Double crit multi two. Geez. Um. 
Yes! Okay. Five link armor. Fucking lordly plate. With life mods have increased effect. Oh my god, and a five link decurve bow. That decurve bow fucks. If only it dropped like that. If only. But then again, I don't use bows anyway. So, for me, this, this baby right here, this is a big win. This is pog. Because this is a low level heist. This is like 36. You can't get, I don't think you can get better than a five link. The hybrid life well, it wouldn't matter it gets removed when you drop it shit league <laughs> like shit league problems like imagine actually getting like to imagine the mods actually existing like, uh, uh, I don't know what it's like Okay. I'm gonna kill these guys because I can. What's up? Alright. Alright, good. Alright. Price successful. Price successful. Let's, let's, uh, bask in our rewards here. That life mods? That's big talk. Um, actually, we didn't have a soul for either, so that's nice. I don't know if, it, if we want it for us, but it's definitely good to have. Um,. Definitely good to have. So, oh baby, oh baby. So we need at least two greens. Possibly more, but at least two greens. I think the rest are red, honestly, like, or three greens and we can do faster attacks. Two greens and we'll probably either do multi, we'll probably do multi-strike. Yeah, I think we'll, we wanna try multi-strike again. Cause like multi-strike's kinda scuffed, but like it's also kinda not. The alternative is faster attacks. Generally speaking, we might be better off with faster attacks. Because the thing is, like, multi strike has more attack speed, faster attacks has increased attack speed. And we already have, like, a little bit of um, attack speed on the passive. <laughs> the passive tree. So, like, this, this more melee attack speed is gonna give us more than like the same number of increased attack speed because of our passive tree. So I think we wanna, well, let's try multi-strike and worst case scenario, we just call it fucking scuffed, right? Um, now, this being said, I don't even wanna, like, I don't even want to do this 30 life roll because we're gonna elk like the biggest dick shit we might the essences we have are actually too high level so like this isn't bad chance to dodge attack hits that's actually kind of cool let's try that no that's a whole lot of nope um so we're just gonna use this we're gonna do this That's too funny. That's a tier 11 life and then a tier 4 hybrid. Fuck this leaf is scuffed. Yo, facts. Um, this isn't bad, but I kind of want it to have a bigger deck. Cause I'm gonna be stuck using this for like for a while. Like I'll probably die before I replace it, which is. Speaking to both how likely it is that I'm going to die and how good the chest piece will be. Um, oh. Oh, it's using all three prefixes for that same scuffed amount of life. Let's try, I just want to try a few more. Um, that was the last scour, I think, right? Let's, let's try a chouse or two. This sucks, but it has Chaos Res, which is cool. And I can put either a resist or not on it. You know what? Ours doesn't really have any life currently anyway. It's just, ugh, it's such a fucking waste. Ooh, suffix, suffix. All right, that's fucking awful as well. The thing is with the strength, it becomes like a 70 life. 
It's just so fucking scuffed. It's such a waste. We're just gonna use it for now. Um, it's a fucking waste. It's such a total waste, but whatever. <sighs> At some point, we'll roll, like, fucking things on it. Um... At some point we'll roll stuff on it, whatever. Alright, now, we gotta go get a multi-strike. Um, we gotta figure out what resistor we need to put on that. Nothing yet, that's good. I mean, it's only a level 30. Yeah, yeah, exactly, like, that's the thing is, it's like... Like, I kept wanting a little more, but I'm really... I'm asking for too much after anything more than this like really I'm, I'm just asking for too much um i don't know i don't need anything specific i just kind of want to put something on it but anyway take a look at something hit chance is good thank you precision multi-strike's gonna be an act five this one this one Chaos Res is negative 30. Like, realistically, I probably should have just kept them on with Chaos Res. It was just so... So... It just felt like such a waste on the life roll. Like, oh, fuck. Okay. Now we can try the multi-strike again. Um, I think we're just gonna get right back to the mapping. Even though we're still, like, two levels away from a double damage fucking... Weapon increase. Oh, and there was that one other weapon that we could use now that was, like, huge. Whoa. Whoa, that felt good. Whoa. Whoa. No. I feel like this is pretty good for getting my poisons up quick or getting my, my stacks and it's fast so it's just fast it always feels comfortable Alright, so now we got a red beast here, so that's gonna be interesting. Yeah, this actually... wow. Wow, that felt really good. I feel like these are not like my best gems at all, but they're like, they're really good quality of life gems. Like, you know what I mean? That's very interesting. You know, now let me do this, like, you know. I mean, these are results right here, baby. These, these are results. What's up? What's up? Talk to Lily for a reward? Yo, I don't even need a reward. I'm still using the level 30 fucking weapon. What's going on? Wait, we forgot about the... We forgot about the toys. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, that's right. The fizz damage roll is what made it, like, a higher level requirement. That's so, like, not bad, though. Oh, right, because this has the speed mod, so this is even a different mod. So this probably has different level requirement. Level 40 even. There's near blue. Well, okay. Link up with the white. Link up with the. Okay. 
Actually, wait, hold on. Let me see, let me see. Zoro is fun to look at. Eh. 21 to 26. It, it's not showing an insane increase, but it's definitely an increase. And I feel like it's, it's underestimating itself. Alright. We gotta get this bitch moving here. We got a point. <clears throat> I know how fast we're gonna make Jesus. Ethical Blade Vortex. Okay. Hmm. I mean, we're pretty much just using Viper Strike to scale for fucking Plague Bearer, but do some half decent damage while it does so. This, this is month level 46. Oh, so I could even farm this and get that weapon if I... Whoa! You know, ethical BV. Ethical BV. <laughs> oh, no. You know... Surprised everything around me dies. We go. I got an abyss when I pop the flask for the fucking Pathfinder shit, it like instantly fills my shit. Yo, don't, don't hit me so hard, fam. Chill. It's chill. It's just, let's chill. Let's all take a breather, breather here. Take a, take a step back. No need to get all hostile. You can stop shooting shit right now, I'll tell you that much. Mm -hmm. Find the missing eye. Gee, I wonder who has that. Who could possibly have the missing eye? Playing dominating blow has made me realize that it's not... For long-term use, that's where it just feels more comfortable. Don't hate the build, just know it won't feel good for long. Uh, do you mean like feel good as in fun and enjoyable, or like feel good as in like it's gonna be hard to continue scaling it as the game scales? Because I think that's historically like been the issue with dominating blow is that like it could be good early on, but the farther in you get with in-game content and stuff, like the more uh, the more of a problem it becomes to keep it caught up. There's no one feel, uh, like just feel good for my hand, gotcha, gotcha. Like it's just not a comfortable play, you feel like. It feels more stress playing it. <laughs> you can't be having that. You can't be having that.
I'm sure I should pick that up because it's like the only sh fucking currency shards I get. So in essence. But you got some damn man. How, I can't believe I never knew about Plague Bear. Like, I knew it existed, but I always just thought it was like some weird scuff thing that you like use and like you set up a five link for it or six and whatever, and you're just like. Finally getting the attack speeds. 3-3 three, three, and then at 12. Two more levels and then we should have like a nice boost. Um, and then it might even be overkill at that point, but I mean, we'll see. It should be, if I keep using multi-strike, it should be insane like speed. Not insane, but it should be like a noticeable boost on what's already good. That's been something I feel like you were working on for pretty much like since you started playing the build. Like since you really started getting into the bigger mouse of it, you were like, yeah, you know what I'm noticing? <laughs> it's an issue. <laughs> Come on, Tukahama. Mother trucker. Unethical Plague Bear! Oh shit. I got one. With the 40% health, most of my tunes had to like... Stop hitting these. supposed to oh there we go I guess I just warm away from it like that yeah that makes sense okay all right plague bear is clapping Ramp up to friend though. I feel like it's something that you don't normally have to think about until like that like there'd only be so many builds, you know, that you really need to like actually think about it. Wait, WV, did you die? Like, it's one of those things that, like, so few builds actually even worry about it, that it's, like, so... Oh, shit, he died, no! That you won't even think about it. Like, you know, I'm in your planning, I mean. Plague Bear is getting fucking big, damn.
40. So like, this is so crazy. So it's like the more, I don't actually need to ramp it up to full, but if I do, it's gonna like give people. Like, you know, like that. Oh my God. That is crazy. Look at that, that was, that was a pack. They were like a champs or something. Where did all this XP come from? Oh my God. This, this was just empty. 10k. 15. Oh my god. Oh, I missed. Okay. Dude, you know that the build's actually popping off when it doesn't feel like the monsters have 40% HP. And you know, for god damn it, I hate these maps so much. Does this at least go in a circle? A build that requires you to do like five different things before going in. <laughs> Sorry, I missed that. Yeah, that would, um. That would, uh. Uh oh. Uh oh, what's Cat's got? What's Cat's got? 3.6 billion XP. Are you still just mapping, or is that like some heist shenanigans? I know you were talking about like the heist XP earlier. Yeah, heist now. So wait, so it's 3.6 mil heist. So so like you're just doing a regular, like a heist or, or contract or whatever, grand heist in the better way. Okay, so it's a grand heist, and you're just like, hey, that dude is wearing a queen of the forest. Um, you're like stalling, you said, right? Like, above four bill, it doesn't show it anymore. Oh my god. So, like, you were saying the, like, you finish, you do the heist or whatever, and then when it's done, you kind of just, like, run around in circles and just farm the mobs for, like, big daddy XP. So that's, that's huge XP. I don't know if it's the best idea to do for hardcore, but I mean the numbers don't lie. Like that, that's big XP. The rooms spawn along the monsters. Oh, oh, like you keep eyes out for the rooms that'll, like for rooms like just sending in a bunch of magic monsters or like a bunch of packs. Then you'll like milk it and get all the juice out. <laughs> it sounds wrong, but you know what I mean. Do some laughs. Yeah, yeah. Check all the reward. So you check all. Oh, oh right, because they're still like you can still open them. There we go. Delirium there. That's always a good test of things. Except for that guy, that guy can suck it. Ooh, baby. We can jump back in five minutes, see how we can get it. Damn, good luck, enjoy. Oh, you're probably already gone by the time. Sorry, but read that late. My bad. the guy who's fucking making everyone invincible. I was a plague bearer, like I never would have actually caught him, that's crazy. 
two passive skills that block spell damage. I feel like there's something in there because I'm holding a shield. Like, I feel like there is a potentially good um, mod in that, that pool for shields. Because, like, yeah, because the two passives is, like, literally... You only click one node anyway, so if the, the regular one's scuffed, it doesn't matter that much. Not that block spell damage is bad, but, you know. It's obviously not a lifer. Hmm. Well, Cluster Jewels will be part of the much later on potential min-maxing. Two point nine again, pug. One point five levels in a couple of minutes. Yeah, you're you're getting you're getting a lot of XP. <laughs> Going really quick over there. It's good to know though. It's worth um worth actually doing them. What do I need to do? I gotta hide my auras. There we go. So now it's a lot, it's gonna be easier to read. My actual buff. I totally missed the boss. Trello. Oh, we are so close to the last node though. Um. We want to like redo the zone. Like, maybe not the whole zone, just like this, like this floor or something. Can I? Can't. Uh. You know what? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna redo the run up to that boss just because that one level we get the big fucking 12% attack speed node with leech. I think it's got a lot of leech too. Like, it's just that's uh, potentially big, big help. 46 to life, fire resist, the tiniest bit of flat fizz, and no suffixes. Feels bad. Um, let's chance this. Nope, okay. Let's do this. Nope, okay. Instant poison. Oh shit, that's not bleed, but if we can get bleeding anywhere else, we should be okay. I mean, we're a pathfinder, so. You know. Oh, oh, but mine never. Mm. Uh, it's my freezing chill. <laughs> oh, bro. Just gonna hold these. Honestly, I, mm, I, mm. it's like I want to use them, but mine are too to kind of niche for what I'm doing right now. I feel like I want to elk this and just see what happens. Didn't even roll a thing. Whatever. Oh, we can use the sword. Is this even better than that chief fucking G one we found? Like, 3082. No, it's not even better. Jesus, Louises. That's insane. Wait, how? This one's so much faster. That's part of why we're so quick. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, that's right. Still scuffed. Scoofade. New prison run, and then... Oh, I gotta refine the whole fucking thing? Oh, Jesus. How's oh, this finger getting up after playing for long? 
Uh, my flask button is on the left side of my mouse, so I can relate. <laughs> Fifty maxed, boom. Is there monster spawns back here? Oh yeah. I feel like I want that. Oh no, it didn't re- no! Gosh darn it. What do we got? This is essences? Uh, can I get more to spawn? I do like essences. No, we cannot. Feels bad. No, I can't get that third one. Eh, yeah, well, we charge. I screwed my mouse too hard. Yep, yeah, my, th uh, my thumb is my, um... For my flash button, it's my thumb, so that's like, that thing feels the burn all day. Someone's also a pancake ATO, yo. That was just flat. <laughs> Oh, the real gamer struggles. That's what it is. Time to see. Should be a little bit quicker, probably not too too much. Yeah, it's a little faster. Life leech does seem pretty good. But that was actually a big thing that we were looking for was like the, not just the attack speed, but also like the life leech gain on it seems really good. Fuck, this isn't music. Here we go. <laughs> Right, dude, that was from the, that was from um, a heist. It, it dropped like shitty, and I was like, this is so cool though with the attack speed. Let me just throw a fucking alchemy on it, and that happened. And I was like, oh my god, it's actually more DPS than that sword that we made earlier, um, because of the attack speed. The Cutlass has like insane attack speed. No. Wait, let me in.
Okay, it's almost boss time. This should be interesting. Baby is quick, though. Ooh. Alrighty, set up a safety, uh, safety corner right here, safe space. Wait, can I actually be clickable? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Come on, Chevron. All right, stage one. I'm gonna pop this fucking fully loaded thing on you. Alright, so that wore out. No, thank you. No, ah, come in there, okay. No. Oh, I gotta kill these books. Okay. Uh, we're very close to full ink you. Got him. Get drained. Whoop. Yo, that bitch got cut. That bitch got cut. Actual damage. Actual damage. <laughs> Actual damage. It's a beautiful thing. Remember when I was ZDPS? I don't. Never happened as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> oh, actual damage. Oh shit, that's with sand stance too. In fucking sand stance because I'm way too terrified to take it off. <laughs> I think I might actually fucking put points in a blind, the damage while blinded, just so that I have an excuse to leave it on. So people don't be like, oh whoa, what the fuck is that so hard? I'll be like, no, 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 you don't understand. Um, this is with the fire drinker, right? Right out of Prisoner's Gate? I think it is. I fucking hate that boss. Fucking fawn boss. Oh uh, yeah, this looks like the way to it. Yeah, and there's Nessa like, Baby, baby, I'm getting married to a fucking crab. Baby, 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 baby. Fucking... Dumbass Nessa. It's a fucking crab. How do you think that's supposed to work? There he is. Alright. I always, before I fight this guy, I've got to, like, double and triple check my fire resist. <laughs> um, we've got some damn here. I mean, some reductions. This is good. Chance to evade. I mean, we're not in a bad way. Okay. Oh baby, that was clean. That was clean. I kind of want to round these guys up and just give them a good smack and just give them a little spank. Oh, I'm getting my stacks off them. Yeah, we're totally doing that. Spank them a little, get 30, 40. Just getting some stacks. Okay, okay. Alright, that wasn't full, but that was like close enough, I think. Watch this call. <laughs> oh, get cooked, motherfucker! Oh, that was calling. That flamethrower trap was supposed to call for me. I forgot I poisoned him to death. Oh, get cooked. Holy actual damage. Imagine doing damage in Quinley as a melee? 
With a shield? We're not gonna look at the fact that I have a five link. We're, we're just gonna ignore that. We're not gonna uh, pay any attention to that. Thank you very much. <laughs> I do not want that to be factored into the equation. Especially like if I can get my positioning good with dash so like everything gets cleaved. Oh man. Wait, why is this guy like there we go. That dude was thick. Alright, but we got our stack, so watch any help. Oh, unethical I mean ethical blade vortex! <laughs> ethical blade vortex! Oh it's okay. Did I miss a waypoint? Yep. Um, but we, mm, as much as that's annoying, we don't actually need that waypoint because we already did. The fire drink is the only thing there. Wait, what the? F Where did this thing come from? Little cheeky bastard. Oh, wait, I didn't really mean to pop that, but bad habits. Oh, I see a waypoint. Uh, yeah, that's probably it for our precision ore, though. Ethical blade vortex. Ah. <laughs> Currency farmer coming. Oh, you want some? Who are you? Who the fuck are you? Oh, there's a whole squad here. Oh, oh you all gonna get it. You have no idea who you're fucking with right now. I'm on fucking beast mode. <laughs> you all dead. Everybody dead. Can't click that one. Okay. Accomplish that goal. Um, do we want to like do one more point and like whoopity scoop these? I don't think we do. I feel like those are like, uh, the thing is the armor too, but it's like they're not really. We could cut through for warrior's blood into heart of the warrior. That would actually be really good if we can justify this area. Maybe for the armor? I don't think we can justify it. The thing is, like, if we spend that one point, we can get these two. Which is 10 life, a bunch of armor, flask life recovery, which is actually good for Pathfinder. Um, we'd probably cut through here for 3, 4, 5, 6, 7% block chance. And 20, well... Fucking 50% defenses from equipped shield is actually really big. And then 20% damn. Some really cheesy all res. Then we get this, which is big. Um, since we're doing like life leech too, that would be especially good. Oh my god, blood fury. Oh my god, why aren't we using blood rage? 
we don't have any life regen that's why we we can't mm, with this and golem's blood we can actually sustain it um and with these we'll actually leech through it too because the total recovery per second dude we are so far away from where we fucking started so here's the thing this is all awesome but we're i don't think any of that is worth it if we're missing a core like core backbone node well like this is just big life but like core nodes like this like this was the fucking two pointer that i was like why have i not gotten this yet right like that's that's a given like we're enjoying doing damage but we don't want that to like break I like like bear drop Sanctified man, oh I'm thinking about like the more I invest into like a uh, plague bearer, like getting juicing that. The more I was wondering if I should put like link it, figure out how to get two blues linked to it, and then get it with um, intensify, which should just be even more radius, right? Like technically, that should just be straight up more radius. I mean, increased radius technically. I just don't know how crazy I can get with these damn blue sockets. That's a problem. So I really, like, obviously I don't want to put on energy shield here. Unless I got, like, a soul tether. Oh my god, what if I got a... Oh my god, what if I got a soul tether? What if I got a soul tether? It's going to be worth, like, half of a chaos. There's got to be at least one. They're actually not that low drop rate. Like, they're, they're pretty common to drop. So there's got to be at least, like, a few up for trade right now. And they're probably, like, one chaos each. Because no one except, like, me and, like, five other people thinks that they're good. Dude, I could so fuck with this whole thing. Because then, like, this, like, getting energy shield wouldn't be a waste. But I'd have overleech which is nice and there is like a pseudo there's something like super niche about um having like gear that just happens to have energy shield on it not be wasted like mm, the thing is i don't want to roll armor and evasion i mean i still want armor and evasion rating gear it would mainly be for the overleech which in itself though is still crazy like that's not bad and like you do get a tiny bit of ES from it. I think I'll probably ask myself the big question for skills now. Can, like, can I play this for three months? Oh fuck, I can't play anything for three months. <laughs> if I'm being honest, though, I never even bother asking myself that question because I'll always say yeah, and then it'll never be true. Sweet. I have to go blade vortex coming through. Don't mind me. I don't know if I'll be okay to play it for like a month. Fair. Fair. The same skill, yeah. Oh. I switch zones, I lose my plague stack, so I just want to run around in a circle and kill things real quick. Okay. <laughs> oh, wait, I skipped the, um. Um, well, there's a waypoint at Beacon. I'll get to Beacon, take that waypoint, and then come back.
Oh my god, I should see like I should start getting a feel for how many stacks I actually need. Oh for a boss though? We're gonna get all the stacks. This is like a mini boss, but So that I can be filthy casual. Why would you want to play a single skill for three months? <laughs> it's like gross. <laughs> play for fun and satisfaction? What the? I don't even know how to spell those words. Is there a Q in them? So that's the actual way to go. Let me see what I stood the test time with last rate. Because last rate's fun as fuck. Um, you know the one thing I never really understood is between last rate and reeve, what the real difference is. Like, now, nah, like in the current state both of the skills are in, you know? Like, what really is the point of having them? Because I played way back when stat sticks happened, like way back when it was like, you could use a skill, it would just only swing with the weapons that were, that match the skills tags. So like if it only used axes, you put on a sword, you would still get all the benefits of that sword being equipped. It was like a quiver, it just wouldn't use it to attack. Um, and Reeve was big back then because we had like these stacked ass fucking fizz to Ellie weapons that just had like three different Ellie or fizz damages extra element. And you just put that on as a stat stick and it just made your reeve like fucking two shot things. But like, I don't get, now that that's removed, as soon as they removed that, I was like, well that build's dead. But then I was like, what? what's the point of reeve? I don't get it. And now like, lacerates all over the place. Like, it's an amazing starter skill. It's an amazing casual skill. It's amazing for like, bossing. It's, it's just an amazing skill, right? Like, it's very well rounded, very safe, very comfortable. Um, but it's like, what, what the fuck is Reeve in the game for still? Like, imagine using Reeve in 2020. <laughs> like, Right, right, but like that's my my question is like what's the difference? I mean, I haven't really like put the two skills side by side, um, so like I mean, obviously that that's where I would see the difference. But it just it's just on like at a glance, you look at the two of them and you're like, all right, this one shoots out big ass arcs and it fucks shit up. Okay, what does Reeve do? It shoots out big ass arcs and it fucks shit up. Uh, okay, so. <laughs> <laughs> like, why is one good and the other not? You know? Oh, he's back to giving me dog shit. But I do really need an armor evasion helm. And, like, I think it's time to try getting rid of Goldrum. Let's just, like, take a swing at it, right? Like, these Alks have been good to me for so far. That was so close to being good. So close. We only have one skill. Let's try Chaos. That's hybrid life? No, that's actual life. It's actually five life. Oh, scuffed. Scuffed. I thought that was hybrid with something. Oh, I guess stun and block recovery. Yeah, that would have been. Oh, is that actually seven stun and block recovery? No, that's high. Oh, yep. Okay. Shit. I don't think devs can reach lacerate tier skill for satisfaction in a lot of skills. Yeah, where he needs to ramp up for AoE and it's like invisible without MTX. It really is invisible. Like, that's not wrong. Even with MTX, it's not that visible. Like, which I mean, like, that's not... That doesn't sound like an actual playstyle impacting issue, but realistically, it actually is. Because, like, if you're trying to figure out, like, if you're trying to outrange, like, you're super nervous, you're playing hardcore, and you're trying to kill stuff at, like, the max range of your skill. 
And it's, it's good to know, like, what kind of radius you're working with, you know? With Lacerate, it's very clear, like, this is what you're working with. Like, show me what you're working with. Reeve's like, nah, fam, I can't show you. It's, it's I, I don't know what to tell you. Ah, what a waste of an essence. Fuck. I had high hopes for that. Fuck. Reduced mana reserve. Yo, Kappa. We're not using that, but still. I think I give up. Yeah, we're gonna have to give up on this. Damn it. It's a damn shame. Ah, what the fuck? What, what the fuck? There we go. It's a damn shame. God damn shame. You still in his league? Yeah, what's up, Ape Jake? It's, um... Well, I mean, we died, but but we made a new character, and then we gave up on that, and now we made a new character, and now we're still in it. It is because of the design; it needs to revamp. Yeah, yeah. How was that? I, I, there, like, there could very well be things that I'm just not familiar with and not aware of with it. Like, very possible. But I really feel like it's just Lacerate has just kind of surpassed it. Like on a million different things across the board, you know? And it's just like, when do... You know, like, when is it... Will that be addressed? You know? Like, are they gonna, like, check it out? Maybe, like, once they get their development caught up, now that, like, Chris Christ Wilson's gonna take over? And be like, hey, I'm gonna get, like, have you guys get your shit in line? Um, maybe like they'll actually get caught up and then they'll be able to deal with shit like that, you know? I should probably get different gloves. Wait, any two green and any red. Okay. So I did just get another 1% life regen. Um, it's probably wishful thinking, but I'm curious if I can sustain blood rage. Ooh! Ooh! Technically, no, but it's so minor that we might as well be sustaining it. It's because of the, uh, how it looks and what it does. Yeah, the whole spiel. Not like what they did to Molten Strike, though. That boy got new. I don't... I don't... What did they do? I don't think I know what they did to Molten Strike. When did it get nerfed? I've always liked Molten Strike, I just never played it, but I always just thought it was such a good, like, core concept of a skill. Dude, this build is fucking destroying shit. Although this is, like, very low level, so it's, like, comparatively, but... This is fun as fuck. Look at me out. Okay. And Blood Rage is working. That's gonna be huge. You can nerf like three times. Um, oh, right. Didn't they like lower the amount of balls and then they made the balls have like less area or something and they uh, just kept not getting love? Getting like the opposite of love? Um, actually, I should keep that for rare belt things. Oh, I didn't do the poison, bro. Let's go fuck his day up. Although I have negative 30 chows. So this guy might be a little trickier. First it was losing the ability to hit without monsters. So it was the losing the threshold jewels and then now it's a chain skill. It's a what? I'm gonna finally put the brakes on precision. I mean, it's definitely better than nothing for that spot. I mean, for that extra mana, but like, you're gonna need some brakes. I feel like we're gonna cut this boss. Oh, and his little fucking pods before the boss. We can use those to get like big boy stacks. And then we can do our unethical blade vortex, or our ethical. Blade Vortex in there. That'll be very fun. 
It's like going through identity. No, no, no. Listen, they will never know the identity crisis, okay? They will never know. Ooh, hey. Even like most of my characters even went through like even like their final builds that they like landed on still went through like 10 different variations or completely other builds before they got there. Like, I'm a professional at having an identity crisis. 78k is my max. Okay, let's go see. Oh, 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 I'm long Johnson. <laughs> That's blood rage, I don't really, ugh. I do need to actually do mechanics. <laughs> this, this much <laughs> we have found out. Come on, dude, can you like not cover yourself in poison? Please? No? Okay. Um. Ah! Come on. Cole, Cole, Cole? Oh no, I just did my fucking thing. Okay, I'm gonna get you with this. And I call. <laughs> what? Why isn't it calling? Why isn't it calling? Oh, I got no mana. Oh my god, I scuffed. I scuffed. <laughs> I'm like trying to throw my flame, my flamethrower trap for the call, and nothing was coming out. And I was like, oh shit, I got no mana. <laughs> That's my panic phrase. That's my safe word. <laughs> oh, I'm so scuffed. I should find Chaos Res on the tree. <laughs> wait, wait. Where's Chaos Res? Where's Chaos Res? <laughs> up here. We're passing all the way up here. That's actually not that hard. But I really don't want to do that. I wish I could just anoint. Oh wow, wow, that's so much gas. 28. 40 chaos res. Ah! <laughs> I don't think we can. We should. But I don't think we can. If we did this idea that we were talking about to get all res, um, that's how the the guy that fucking died. R.I.P. Um, that's how that tune had like really good chaos res. He had like 60 fucking, or I think like 50% or something. Um, but that's how he had like some bonus all res from the tree, so he would just wear like scuffed boots that had move speed chaos and nothing else. Um, do we go for the other poison? I feel like we just scoop up that life real quick while we're here. Right, yeah, let's just scoop that up real quick. Now I think... 2k life, fortify, I feel like we do want to actually switch over to defensive. Yeah, you know what, we're definitely doing like good damage and we definitely need to um, switch back over to getting more tankiness and try to get back to zero DPS. Cause this is fun, but it's kind of scary. And like that boss fight wasn't a good example cause that's all chaos damage. Um, but yeah, still, still. We full? Yeah, we've been full. Let's get it. No. 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 Yo, does Blade Bearer have an MTX? I'm not kidding. Like, this might need to happen. Wait, but wait, but wait. I'm missing, here we go. Can 46 do it? Yeah, wow, even at half its fucking stacks, it's able to like, just cut things. Look at that, oh my god, that's insane. That means I can just punch like three enemies and then go. Like right here, like this pack. That's it, we're good to go. Meow. 
That's insane! Why did that scale so hard? You know, I've got all of these things to level. Too many crickets. Seventy-seven. I'll just fucking turn this on right here. Don't mind me. Just swoopity scooping past. <laughs> no big deal. Ethical blade vortex. Don't mind me. Ethical blade vortex. <laughs> uh, let's do blood rage because we feel like we're swagging. I think I can make this thing dance, ready? Oh no, I couldn't do it. It was like, oh, I did it a second ago. I think it's like right here. No, there's a way you could stand. Yeah, right there, look at that. Okay. <laughs> oh wait, no, come back. Oh, I'm scuffed. Scuffed leveling extraordinaire. Oh wait, we're maxed out, AFK. I'm actually having a lot of fun now. I'm not gonna lie, I really did not think I was gonna have this much fun. Um... I've gotta go make and eat dinner, good luck man. Alright Keith, you take care, you enjoy your dinner. Hope you uh, hope you're eating good over there. Talk to you later, thanks for stopping by as always. Appreciate it. Oh shit. Here we go. No. Oh, it's all. I was like, wait a minute. Have you checked? Have I checked for it? Dinner? I wasn't cooking dinner, I don't think. Was I? Oh no, Plague Bear. Wait, I want to level it. Oh. Whether actual poison for it might actually be better because it's more damage of poison instead of flat. Um, I, so, I, here's the thing. Um, I haven't checked, but the reason I haven't checked is two things. Two, two things. One, I don't have a 100% poison chance without it. So, to get a 100% poison chance without it, I need this guy, and then I need to get these guys. That being said, I do want to get those, and I do want to get to a point where I can take out. Um, lesser poison But once I get to that point I do want to look into it. Yeah, um, but there is also the fact that melee fizz Exists because melee fizz isn't just 30% fizz. It's like 30% fizz and 30% with uh, ailments So it's actually like it it actually double dips on damage So it's like a, it's very funny, but um, when I was looking through POV earlier, I was very surprised I was like most of the things that make this good for, for Viper Strike specifically, aren't even poison support skills. Like, its best support skills are red gems. Like, it was very interesting, but it actually makes a lot of sense because Poison Strike is a attack. Like, at its core, it's a punch. Which is why I like it. Um, but yeah, that's definitely a really good point. Because regular poison, it's like up to 60% or something, right? Like, it's a very high more multiplier. Ah, uh, for poison dam. Right now, I'm kind of just like cheesing Plague Bearer. Like, I'm almost positive that Multi Strike is in no way, shape, or form my best option for the the build currently. But god damn, it's fun! <laughs> like, god damn, it's fun! And, like, I've got the fifth, the five link from the heist, so I can get away with it. You know, like with uh, doing something like that. I think I want, oh, I could scale swords. I still haven't even imagined scaling swords. My crit chance is 6.9, even if I get that whole fucking arc, it's like gonna be seven. Um, I think I want to actually work towards these so I can better sustain um, the thing with the stuff. 
So what I'll probably do instead of pathing through all of this, which I do eventually want to do, is right now just get like these two points and then this, so I can rush the regen, um, get Heart of the Warrior, and then put points into here. And then like once I finish, or once I'm like two points away from this being done, I just refund and switch around. So, that sounds like a play. What the fuck are you? Oh. Ooh, do I want knockback? Am I gonna be like some kind of a fucking weird pleb who does knockback? Yo. No, no, maybe, no, maybe, no, maybe. Um, we do have fort. Oh, this is double dipping on fort with effect. This has armor, this has effect. 10% effect while stationary. This seems super suspect. But this is like 2% more damage. Actually, wait, it's 10% effect. 5%, 5%. So it's 20% effect, but that's like 20% of 20. It's like 0.2 times 2. Um, 0.2 times 20 equals 4. So it's, so it's 4% additional damage reduction. But I never remember if it's from all sources or just physical. I think it's just physical, isn't it? From hits. No, it's from everything but from hits. So that's 4% less damage taken from all hits. Which is actually really big. But... I think that's like something to go on the back burner. Honestly, I think that's like a back burner thing. But definitely worth keeping in mind because we're still we're still cheesing with like sand stance, right? Like we're still doing what we can. Come on, Nessa! God damn it! I always like with this fight. I think she starts right here. I always try to figure out like where I can put a safety portal. And it's like always scuffed. So I don't want to take it during her water phase because then you can actually die. Like you can come back dead, like wake up dead. Ow. Ow. Oh, no thank you. Okay, I lied, I'll take some. As soon as I activated Plague, she was like, nah fam. Okay. Whoop! Ha! <laughs> Just kidding. I thought you were gonna hit me. Alright. Yeah, well, we're like way. I've gotta be quick with that play because I didn't even get to use it all the way. Whoops! No one saw that. Whoa! Is that gonna hit me? Yeah, I think that totally hit me. 20k. Oh, baby, we're on the last phase. Dude, calling strike with the fucking claps. With the fucking claps. Do I want the blue that bad? I don't think I do. Oh. That's actually, now that you mention it, now I'm wondering if I should actually get that poison shit faster. I feel like I really, really want Blood Rage to, to be live. Because Blood Rage, I mean, it's mainly a clear spell, like I really shouldn't be using it on bosses, but I think if you have enough regen, you can. Like, at a certain point, I think it's in your damage, it actually does become worth using where you leech more than it's taking away. But like, like to the point that the amount it takes for you to leech more than it takes away is very minimal. 
but the amount it takes for you to have a more incoming life with it on versus without it is actually kind of brutal. But I think it's just like a damage check. Cause it's like, you know, the same thing as like how Leech sucks when you're leveling and then it's really good later. Oh yeah, wait, I'm doing this. I think I want that Sanctified Flask, right? Yeah. Oh, we got three on the chest. Hmm. You're getting slowed. We need like curse immunity or something. Wait, hell yeah. We just killed a 40% life red beast during some scuffed ass leveling. And like, oh my god. I don't know, it felt pretty good. I mean, we obviously didn't face tank him and get too rowdy. Like, it's not too much to brag about, but like, with, you know, properly like running and, and dragging him, it did feel really good. Check that mana. Throw like a transmute at it, see what happens. Oh, we forgot Waylum Silver Locket. Whatever will he do? Is that another delirium? Oh my dear. Okay, get in there. Here we go. So good. Oh, that'll be so good for temple too, like the incursions. I'll just get plague bear before I go in there, and then just be like, "Sup," and then fucking run through it. Oh my god. That guy's a mute. That guy's hexproof. It's the only reason he lasts that long. I want that on paper. Oh wait, oh I'm so close to, wait wait, come here, come here, ah, ah, fuck. Woo! Come on. Three! Nice, we got it. Wait, did I ever get a waypoint? Oh, scuffed, we did not. Um... We actually got rares! We actually found rares! They do exist! They're in the deliriums. <laughs> oh my god, it's so troll. 
I've got to admit, I really don't like that part of it, of the league. Um, like, I feel like it's just... It puts such a, like, gimped requirement on... Ooh. For Ignite. Ah, fuck me. I mean, that is a thing I use. So wait, so this is a four passive. So let's put that in the good tab. Um, and then this needs an AUG. Uh, oh wow. If I... Oh fuck, if I scale crit I actually got some jewels going. This one's fucked though. Let's go for... Um, we need transes. Yeah. Bubbling, Catalyst, Surgeon, oh Surgeons. Surgeons of, oh we got no logs, oh well. Let's, you know, let's keep these. I feel like we're not keeping any Sancties. What did I just put in there? Yep. Um, and let's put this in the shitty unique tab that we, at one point, will clean up. It's a five pass of Herald. Oh Jesus, go figure. Um, I feel bad for Whale, I'm like, he's just standing there, like, trying to find this locket, but, like, at a certain point, he's, he's gotta look himself, like, he can't just rely on everyone to do everything for him, you know, like, at a certain point, man, you know, how do you expect, do you expect to just fall out of the sky, like, what's going on here? You know? You know, that reminds me of something, that always makes me wonder, where do, think about this, right? Where do these vendors get these books of passive skill points? Right, like, where on earth do you even farm something like that? And even once you get one, like, how does one put a value on that? You know, I guess, I guess you could think about, like, I don't think, you don't get a passive for the locket. But, like, just as an example, actually, you might, I forget. But just as an example, like, um, like, let's say the locket, you know? Like, this is super serial family heirloom it's like super important to him and it's this whole thing like alright I can understand you being like you know what I would trade the most valuable item I have in the world for this it's that important right like good on you like I, you know but then you think like some of these cards are like just kill some bitch I guess the ones that are like just kill some bitch I guess you gotta think about it as like the entire town like gets together and they all pitch in and they all like use all their most valuable belongings and like everything they can do to like somehow acquire this like ancient legendary tome of fucking awesomeness and they're like the only way we can get rid of this tome like the only uh, thing we would give this up for is if we can save our village from this like crazy cycle bitch named piety you know and like meanwhile piety like for all they know, like, Piety and us could be working together, because she's been getting us passive skill books for fucking ages. <laughs> like, yeah, that could be, we could be in cahoots, but we have no choice. We're, you know, we're shaking them down. Ain't nothing they can do about it. Sucks to be a village person, man. That's all I'm saying. It's a rough life. Ooh, lacquered garb. We like chancing the lacquered garbs in hopes that we get a Cloak of Defiance and then we will make a MOM character. Because all the ones that we made without it die. <laughs> so, that's uh, pretty solid reasoning. I think I really like Agnostic MOM, but uh, that cloak is just so fun good. 
Although my guy on, my totem boy on SSF HC is like, he's pretty thick, you know? He's doing his thing. He doesn't have it, but he's agnostic mom. Am I, I'm at 81k, let's just, where am I going? Down south? Almost to the border? Let's go. Meow. Oh fuck, there's nothing left. 46k, fully reset, what a waste. What a waste of some juicy stats. I want more than 40k, I want to insta give things. 50k, yeah, that should be enough. Meow. We're not insta giving, but we might as well be. It's just juicy. We like this. Oh, we lost it. Seventy. Oh, that dude just juiced me. Let's get it. Swim. 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 Oh. So pretty much like Plague Bear. So this is like, I guess I can't really scale it at all, but it's just, the, it's limited to... I guess at the highest possible value, it's limited to the cooldown of the skill, which is like, what, like one second or something stupid? Like, yeah, it's like one second. But the logic is like, isn't the maximum stats like 999,000 or something like that? So like, I guess it would just be like, yeah, you get that as quick as humanly possible, and then you just keep turning it on and off, I guess? Oh no, because no matter what it's doing 12.5% of that maximum. So there is a maximum amount of time that it can roll. And then the most damage you can possibly get at it is if you can get up to that maximum amount in a short amount of time. Hmm. It's not like, oh, if you can hit the 999K in two seconds, you do the full amount every two seconds because it's no matter what, it's limited to that 12%. That Unless, I wonder if you can get like, put like rapid decay on it or something. Or like, reduced cooldown. Like if there's a way to, not cooldown, um, reduced duration. And if there's a way to make it like, drain faster. You know? Like not for less damage, but like, more damage, but in a shorter time. Does it have a duration tag? Well, uh, mm, does it? I feel like people have already tried this though. Spell Chaos AoE, that's it. Ooh, okay. Yeah, I guess not. Well, I guess at a certain point, if you get to the point where it's not worth using anymore, you're fucking one shot in giant packs, right? Like, you gotta be fucking thick at that point, I'd imagine. Probably like not a realistic concern for SSFHC. Like on a private league. I don't know, maybe. Hmm. hmm. I don't know why I'm reading this. I know they're all shit. This claw is actually, well, it's level 40. Also, like, I'm not replacing my weapon anytime soon. Ooh. Ooh, that's actually not a bad roll. The problem is that, like, I need enduring. Feels bad. Yo, Wailing, come take this fucking cherished relic. I'll fucking throw it out, don't test me. Oh, oh! Boys. 
we're live. We can now do heist, delve, anything the game has. Because my favorite flask has finally joined our ranks. I have 27 bottles, I'll just send them like this. Cast speed does nothing for us, tell me more. Poison? Reduce charges used. This onslaught, we're like not even fucking failing, honestly. We're already like too scaled for it. Alright. That's good. Fuck. First day of trial done. Oh, what's up, Deadly Grats? Wait, first. What? Oh, the first trial. Right, 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 right. Nice. Good shit. Good shit. Yo, I'm gonna be catching up to you. This plague bear guy, yo, he's yo. Mark my words, this dude's gonna be laying some dick down. Mm -hmm. that yeah it's armor evade it looks so stupid but that's that's what we were looking for did we forget to go that way no 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 we're doing good Talk to Alina. Oh, oh, I'm supposed to go through the thing with the stuff. I think I'm wasting time out here. Hundred K that thing can get up to now. Oh my god.
Ooh, I can go. Oh, um, wait, where the fuck am I going? I guess that spot to the right? Or is it down here and it's like a bridge? That's very possible. Nope, not down here. I don't know, is that down? Where the f is it in that corner? Am I losing my marbles? <laughs> the tiny little corner had that bridge. Sneaky son of a beeswax. Where am I at? Oh, there's the door. Um, 67k. It'll probably reset anyway. Let's go see. Oh, I hate that ghost. Oh, wait, she just moved. I gotta kill her before she gets there, ready? Shoom. Shit, shit, shit. Oh, got her! No, she got in. Oh, scuffed. Oh, it's an actual thing that's happening. Actual thing that's happening. That. Dude, it's that ghost. That ghost makes him fuck. And I didn't have a. He did like super bleed poison or something on me. Oh my god, okay. That that was that was quite the scary. Oh look at that. Where is the Fucking like Um I'll uh, we'll just do this later. That was fucking close. Oh so now now uh, we got Warriors Blood, so we should technically like technically we should be able to um Sustain. Oh, I didn't do a TP at all, did I? Ah, oh, feels fucking bad. What's wrong with me? Should be able to sustain this. Yep. Sweet. Oh no, he's still gonna be there and he's still gonna be juiced. Oh. 
Oh, right, he doesn't go away. Oh no, I, oh, I just used my thing. You guys see like right here, I'm out of my flask. Gotcha, bitch. These are all the portals and get a new map. Nah, man, we, we fucking send it. We don't, <laughs> easy, easy. Yeah, it was, it was, it was the, I don't know if that was poison or bleeding, I, I didn't actually, I could probably see in the clips just out of curiosity. I feel like it would be poison, right, because he's chaos? But he definitely puts like something on, um, like some heavy dot on. I just have no idea what that is. I kind of just want to see, like, for my own reference, like I'm watching the corner. I'm watching up here. See, fucks my ass with something. Oh no! I know. Right oh, I there. That was thing. bleeding. That was bleeding. Char charlatan's grip. Wait, I need to know this. I see like right here I'm out of my flask. I'm so curious. Charlatan. Physical de- Whoa. All affected monsters apply a physical bleed effect on hit. Oh that's what was going on! Yo, that dude on every hit? Grip. He had grip. So he had puncture on hit. Summons purged fluids. What the fuck? So this was like the worst possible form of shit that could have happened on him pretty much. Oh, this one probably could have sucked too. Ally steals substantial there. Dude, that's fucking stupid. Yo, why is that allowed? This game is so fucking beta. Like, <laughs> what the shit, dude? What the shit? Like, what, you just keep resetting him until you get like, I mean, I guess, yeah. But like, still, dude, what the fuck? Would have been such a shitty way to go. We ain't going out, wait. We ain't going out like that, boys. We here. We here. We ain't letting that shit happen. Right, and then right here I died of shock, watch. <laughs> Not again. Oh, jeez, imagine. Why are enemies allowed to be afraid? Dude, right? Yeah, like, why am I not just, like, punching target dummies in the face? I don't understand. Like, would it be so hard to make that a game? <laughs> Dude, no, but it's not... <laughs> so, wait, no. But it's not a question, like, why are they allowed to be a threat? It's like, that boss, right? You could fight him 300 times. Well, that, that was... That's probably not... Right? You could fight him 20 times and never get a spirit like that and it's totally fine but then if you you fight him once with the spirit all of a sudden he fucking eats your face cuts your dick off and feeds it to you and you have absolutely no idea why like that's insane and like that charlatan's grip thing like there's no way in the game to figure out what that is or what that does and like you can't even really like see that he like you can't even read it on his portrait without like Dying like if you stand there and try to read what was on it like you're dead And then what are you supposed to do just tell him to hold on a sec while you google it like no like it's like, like that's just that's not that's not you know 
Like, that's not good design. If he always had it and he just always did that type of AIDS, you would at least know to expect it. You know what I mean? Like, there's, there's a big difference between, like, having a hard boss fight like that and the game having cancer. Why am I take a screenshot and pull it out? Okay, listen, not everyone has a computer. Okay. <laughs> this, listen, it's not always as straightforward. Like, what about little Bobby Smith, who's just out here trying to have a good time, trying this game out, you know, he doesn't know what's going on. He's fucking following the quest line. He's doing what they tell him. And all of a sudden, this dude comes out and cuts his dick off. Like, that's not fun. You know? Hey, come on. That's one thing I've always absolutely despised about PoE. Everything, like, I love the game. And I love the game so much. And I love it for a million reasons. But one thing I've always... Was that the dick getting... Oh, that was a face. <laughs> one thing I've always despised about the game with a fiery passion is that the most random fucking things in the game can randomly have things happen where they become stronger than like the boss at the end of the act. Or like you could be doing maps, you can be in a tier five, like my when my fucking big exert boy died. He died in a tier one map and within one second he took more damage than every single boss in the entire game almost combined. In one set, like, he, d he took more damage than any one attack from any boss in the entire game. More damage from that in, than any of those in one second. And, well, pre-end game. Like, in the campaign. More damage than any campaign boss can do in any attack. In one second. And it was just in the most random fucking, random mob in a map. Completely fucking random. And, like, we all, we know why it happened, and it was super scuffed, and, like, yeah, like, I should have been a lot more careful about that mob, but it's just, like, I'll admit that, like, because I know that that's a thing, and because, like, I know that I'm playing the game, like, that's my fault, and I get that, but I just despise that it's possible. You know what I mean? Are you talking about one of the clips? Yeah, the, the one that says, like, shock, delirium, beyond, ass rape, or something like that, because that's... Yeah, it was in a delirium mirror. Um, it was like some random beyond spawn that had like uh, lightning fucking something. And he like spammed out 8 million like shock effects on me and fucking just, just ultra nuked me with some delirium shit too. And I, j I just instantly died. And it's like in that one second of me dying, like that guy, that character was face tanking every single boss in the game no problem like he was built like a fucking thug and he was just face tanking the entire game and then that happened i didn't even have a chance to figure out what was going on and again like it's my fault like i should have known that they and beyond don't matter they just tanked all the lightning walkers yeah but like that's my point, is that I can tank every single boss in the game and this one random ass motherfucker pops out and does my entire- everything I have in one second. Like, that's not cool. Like, I- again, it was my fault, and I get it. I'm not bitching that it happened, but I am bitching that that kind of thing can happen in the game. I don't- I, I feel like it, it's too much. It's just too much. Like, sure, there should be some mobs that are a little harder than others, um, there should be some things that pop out and you're like, oh fuck, that's scary, like, I gotta, you gotta react. But there's a difference between that and just seeing something and, and, like, it doesn't look any different from any other mob until you're dead. Like, that's what I don't like. But, I mean, everyone has something they don't like about a game, right? Like, no one likes everything about a game at all times, always. Like, that's, that's the one thing above all other things that, that if I could change about PoE, I totally would. And I'm sure there's a bunch of people who wouldn't change it, um, and half of them probably play softcore, but that's the one thing that gets me a little, a little, a little, you know. And what's interesting, too, what I think about a lot is I think there's a, a large amount of people 
who would play hardcore if that kind of thing was more like balanced and even, you know what I mean? Did he just die from poison or did I break the event by going to town? Oh, he died from poison. That works. <laughs> um, well, there is things that aren't meant to be face tanked. I don't like losing all my Oculus games when I believe Facebook. Yeah, like, you shouldn't be able to face tank your Oculus <laughs> games with Facebook. But, like, yeah. No, like, that's ass. I, mean, I, mean, I think that's totally unrelated, but that's definitely ass. I don't know. There has to be a way they can get that back. Maybe. Maybe not. I guess it depends on how the delete happens and who's back, like, what kind of backups everyone has. I get what you're saying. He just brought up something similar on a podcast the other day. Did he? I like to hear that. I, I fucking... Ziz and Ziggy D, I have, like, the utmost respect for when it comes to this game. Like, because there's other people, like, Cute Dog. I love watching his videos. I think they're funny and, like, he's good people. But, like... Ziz and Ziggy D would be, like, if the game had dads... You know what I mean? Like, it would be them. Many big things in PoE will not deal a lot of damage. But then some tiny, un yeah, unobvious, like, they, yeah, yeah, that's my point. Do insanely big damage. That's my point. Not that it happens, that it's unexpected. That's my point. That's, that's a much better way of summarizing it than, than what I was saying. It's not that it happens, it's that it's completely unexpected and there's no warning. Until you're dead. Unless you're like way overstacked on defensive layers. Like, and that's the thing in hardcore, and everyone says about hardcore, you have to be so overly defensive stacked that like you can't just be like thick when it comes to mobs. You have to be literally immune to damage when it comes to white mobs, because then you're still gonna almost die to some random ass fucking spider that has 300 mods on it. And it's like... Like, when you know about it, you know, you know to expect it. But that still doesn't make me like it any <laughs> anymore, you know what I mean? And like, that shock guy. Just to keep using that as, as an example, and not that I'm bitching about it, like, that was, that was, a, that was a comical death. Um, he shouldn't have just been some random monster that spawned. Like, for the amount of damage he did... It should have been this giant ass motherfucker who like screamed out and roared on the screen. And that gives you time to go, oh shit, wait a minute, something's about to pop the fuck off. And like you take a step back, you don't just walk up to him while he's like roaring and letting out a battle cry. You know what I mean? Like, something like that would let you know like shit's about to go down. But there is no warning, shit just goes down and then you go down and then it's over and you make a new character. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It's just certain things, like that specific character. I like using him as an example because like the other character that died, that was literally a bug. That's not supposed to happen. But that guy, like the way he died was completely normal. Like that will kill people. Like that's that did exactly what it was supposed to do. Everything was functioning as intended. I just don't like that that's how it's intended. The visual communication of what magnitude of damage expects not very- Exactly, exactly, that's- yeah, that's exactly what I'm getting at. Like, like, give me some kind of a cue. Even if there's like a giant fucking red exclamation mark on my screen before that mob spawns. Some type of like- delay the mob comes out and roars like something to just indicate oh shit it's about to get real not just like because here's the thing the, the way ARPGs work not just PoE the way ARPGs work in general since they fucking existed is that you're like I shouldn't say since they existed but the way ARPGs work since post Diablo 2 like after D2 is just fucking send it like, you just go. Like, you have your homie, you're decking him out, and you just fucking shit up. Like, you're just going, right? Like, that's the point. That's what people play it for. It's like a hack and slash RPG. Like, that's what ARPG is. By definition. 
And that's what people look for. That's why they go to this and not like a regular RPG, like fucking an MMORPG type game. You know, that's why people come here. Nobody wants to stop and read every single fucking mod that a rare has. Like that was one of the biggest complaints people had with Diablo 3 when it first came out. Is that you couldn't actually fight rare packs in hell or whatever the mode was. You had to actually, like as soon as you saw their color, you had to stop and be like, Oh god, it's a pack, let me read its mods, am I gonna die, do I have to dodge, do I have to stay? Like, it was an actual thing and it turned off like countless people instantly because they were like that's fucking stupid that's not what i'm here for oh shit so real i'm still so fucking jealous of my bro thank you i appreciate it yeah no i'm going on a rant um i don't remember how we got here but i was going on a rant we were pretty much talking about how like the how did catmaster say it? he summarized it so fucking well um the visual community what he said the last thing he said in chat <laughs> That is like the best summary of it. And it was, oh right, it tangented because of that close call I had earlier on this guy. We're like, that's actually not the best example. The close call I had earlier isn't a good example because you know that there's the spirit. I knew going into it that there was a spirit affecting him. And if I would have died to that, it would have been beyond my fault. Like it would have been so my fault, I don't even know what to say. And I would have felt like a complete fucking idiot. Um, so, like, that's not a good example. But that is more of an example of the type of thing that should happen. There should should be, like, you see that spirit ghost, right? You see that blue ghost. You see her fly into the enemy. You see the enemy get this crazy weird green shit circling around him. Like, there are multiple signs telling you, like, yo, this could get rowdy. Like, you're like, this could be a problem. You know, like, that's the kind of thing that should happen. You know, yeah. But someone who is new to the game might not understand how they're fighting the enhanced version of the Xbox. Right. Um, right, right. That's a, that's a whole nother, like, th that's a thing that I think it's, like, a fine line when I try to, like, when I bitch about this stuff. Because... I think it's generally assumed, it's definitely assumed by the developers, that if you're playing on like a hardcore mode, you've already beaten the game, you've already played through it. In all fairness, there is no beating the game, so like there's never a point in time where someone has enough knowledge to like just know everything and play hardcore. Like that just doesn't happen. There's like two people who can just comfortably play hardcore and know for sure exactly what stats they need for every boss at any point in time to survive every attack they have. Like, while still min-maxing their damage, and you know what I mean? Like, like that's not... That's not a big list. Um... But, like, that's part of why hardcore gets no play. Like, I would like to do hardcore. Um, like, I mean, I'm, I am. <laughs> but I would like to, like, play it with people like when a league starts and everyone's on and all your homies are playing and everything's like lit i would like to do that in hardcore mode but like imagine fresh like new league starting in hardcore like i can't imagine i started this one on softcore like thank god but like i can't fucking imagine this this league start of hardcore like i was watching like watching ziz made me want to cry like i felt i was, I was like uh, Dude, why is this possible? <laughs> I think, oh, do I want the block chance or the armor? I feel like I only need like four, three or four blue sockets. So I should be able to get away. I'm gonna still need like a cast and damage taken set up. So I need plenty of greens and reds so I can get value. Sorry, I'm totally tangenting onto this, I can get value out of this armor. I think I want the armor. Let's do that or block chance. What's my armor already? It's o U R fucking retarded. But yeah. Yeah like yeah even people who aren't new though. That's my biggest complaint is like you don't have to be new to be surprised by so many things in this game. 
Like, even if it's softcore and you don't lose your character, it still feels bad. You know, no one wants to die. It feels a lot less bad, though. But, <laughs> but yeah. Oh, it says movement speed, too? Oh, that's fucking tempting. That's comically tempting. Shit, I don't know. I want more of something and I don't know what. My race buddy is taking a longer break now and I'm already past some seconds to go to bed now. Oh damn. Chee chee. Uh, well, you have a good night, kids. Thanks for stopping by. Good talking to you. Good luck with um, kicking your friend's butt in the race. <laughs> Gotta get to 93 too. Weren't you like 70 earlier today? You were like 78, I think, at one point, and you were like, yeah, yeah, I'm doing this, look at this XP, and there's a screenshot of you being like 77. Like, what the fuck? That's kind of nuts. It's like insane. Actually insane. 1% max res. The 38 at the start of the, of the race. Oh yeah, that's right. I forgot you said that. You're like, yeah, we're doing this race. I'm 38. <laughs> LOL. <laughs> I, I like this. We're gonna leave with this. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> Tied too much hole in it. Oh, good shit though. That's crazy good on the fucking um, like XP per hour and shit. Take care, have a good night. Yeah. Wonder the I feel like so oh uh, you know what? I guess hmm. How much evasion I gotta double check because I'm pretty sure my tree had like a good amount of increased evasion rating from tree. Um so if it did have that and uh, what the fuck? I hit this guy. So I want like armor and EP items. I don't want either just. But if it, if I ended up like scuffing my percent EV somehow, I could go just armor. But I'm pretty sure I want hybrid. The thing that sucks is like the chest piece is gonna unfortunately end up being like whatever the damn game gives me for a six link. Um, most likely. If I could be like working on, I think like isn't Belly of the Beast a hybrid? Not that well, I have to find the fucking thing first. But still. <laughs> Why am I failing at finding the entrance? Here, maybe. Yes. Okay. Boom, there we go. Oh, hey, leave me alone. I popped it. Oh, there we go. I was like, I popped this and then there was like no enemies. Oh my god, even with the HP, like the 40% HP, if I have a fully charged Plague Bearer, Plague Bearer it insta gimps freaking champ packs. It's insane.
hunting for some fireflies. They should have given you like a jar for this. Like that actually, I think that would've been kind of comical. If they were like, you know, it was like, it's it's so drastic. We need a magical enchantment to open up the fucking path to get to the, the dude that I need you to kill. Use a damn glass jar. <laughs> Go catch some fireflies. <laughs> Thanks. Like, it's like, seriously? She'll be like, yeah, by the way, the, the fireflies are surrounded by, like, super evil monsters that, like, eat us. And they'll be like, oh, okay, well, that makes a little more sense now. Isn't it an industrial jar, though? Because, <laughs> like, it sounds a little troublesome. But, like, this, like, she's got me just grabbing them and bringing them in by hand. Like, they're not gonna be okay. I guess she doesn't need the, them a lot. Like, live fireflies? But I, I don't know, it would've been cool, you know? Maybe they would've been better. Maybe the dude wouldn't have fucking eaten oak if I brought her live fireflies. So all she had to do was give me a jar. You know, I don't know. Well, I know, I mean, well, I know. I hope I keep my poison stacks for this boss because I hate this boss. Yes. And my blood rage, send it full. Not good. Seven stacks. Does anyone know how to reset these stacks? Because I've literally never figured it out. What's his name? Grook Thol? <sighs> I've literally never figured out how to reset these stacks. Weight of despair. Oh, what the fuck is this? Who are you? Okay. I'm in town, right? Yeah, okay. <laughs> right, that. That despair. How do you get rid of it? Why does this guy only have one stack and I have seven? <laughs> Said every 10% life loss, so I guess. I don't think he's at 30% life, but that makes sense, I guess. He might be. It's using Barrage? What a fucking baller. Oh! He's got chinkity chunk. Well, this is probably like software. I mean, you wouldn't make that build guide on. How do you reset the stacks? Like, what? Ha. Bing bong. Yo, what's up, Keith? Dude, do you know how to reset this guy's stacks? I got him at 7 and I don't want to go back in my portal. He almost get bing bing many times. Right? This dude's getting clapped. But like, what's funny is I have like 10 times his health and the same thing's happening to me. Um. Damn, no, that guy's getting chunked. But like, he's still at 9 stacks. That's it? What, you just fight him and hope you don't fucking die? What? What? Hmm. <laughs> Same thing. I don't get it. I, I don't get it. Heck, when she's locked in the upheaval or slam animation. <sighs> I don't get it. So 
like he has to have that many stacks. Oh, what the fuck? Okay, well, that was very anticlimactic for how much fucking climactic for how much fucking time I put into researching that and ultimately finding out that there's no answer and that the fight just sucks ass. It is an optional fight though, so like I guess if you want to be nitpicky, like that's the excuse for it being a dog shit fight. But that's another one that's always bothered me. Like what? Do you, like uh, I don't know. I don't know, man. That dude's a thug. That guy's a thug. But like, so that's. That guy is a good example of something that's not applicable to my complaint earlier. Because if you played through the game on, let's say, softcore, right? Like, you're a new player, you played through the game on softcore. You fought that boss, you know that that boss fucks. You know that, like, when those stacks get high, you could die. Like, you know that's a thing. There's no surprise when you go back and do it on hardcore. The random ass lightning specter that just pops out and tells you, hey, you're dead, bye. Like, the, the, that's a surprise. I really don't want to use this ugly fucking hand. Oh my god, it's so fucking ugly. Give me that one. Alright, it's not good anyway. Alright, like, that, like, Grook Thol always fucking rape. Like, he always rapes. You know what I mean? Like, there's nothing. There's no extra mods, there's no no shenanigans, like, I mean, it's, he is a map boss though, and like, causeways or whatever, I forget what it's called. Burial chamber? I, he's, my, he's a boss in something, but not counting the maps. Like, he always does the same thing. He does get insanely overtuned when he's low on life, but he always is that in tuned. It's not a surprise. You know, certain things. That's it's the surprises that tick me off. I'm like, bam, really? So here's the question: Do I go armor with move speed? Diamond skin's a big dick. Or do I go solidity for more block chance? And the 20% damage is really not going to matter. Like the more I level, the less that matters, right? Like I got some here. I guess I'm not gonna get too too much, honestly. I got some here. I guess in the long run, I really well, then there's this. If I eventually get this, then this would be another. Seven percent damage, that's a joke. Like, I feel like I want diamond skin. I don't think I have enough armor yet for it to actually be relevant. But like, like, I'm gonna have more armor. Wow, I really need to make a new shield. What the fuck am I doing? <laughs> Wait, why am I still losing this? Wait, what the fuck? It has armor evasion rating and energy shield. This is... Oh no, and then I'm gonna get armor boots. So I still have a lot more armor to get. I want one of them. I think I go with the shield. 36% chance to block. Like, that would bring it up to 43%. Actually, I would just be doing two points. Because then I would do this point from here anyway, to get these. So what if I like, cause I do want to have the res, the reses handy. So if I'm just doing the two points, I think, I think diamond skin's actually the play. I think that's actually a play. It gives me a little movement speed too, which is a low key flex. That shield is definitely signs I will survive at all costs. Also sanity slipping away. <laughs> I will <wasn't laughs> It is, a, it is a valid sign of both of those things. It's like this man is persistent. He will battle with anything. No matter what that case is, he will do what he can to survive. On the flip side, this man has lost his fucking mind. Why is he not upgraded to shoot? Oh no, I want armor. I 
Oh, so I need new gloves. Man, these are life. That's, that one's kind of funny about this specific league, is that like, that's a thing, like you have to occasionally just buy shit from a vendor and just fucking upgrade it. It's no big deal, normal fucking content. That's hybrid life! That's hybrid life! We just made new gloves. We just made new gloves. By any means necessary. We just made new gloves. Nice! Resist still good. Our cold and light is through the effing roof. I think fire we're gonna have to deal with after... Uh, oh, we're actually... Yeah, no, that's... We are... Wow, we are way over. That means we need chaos res bad, is what that means. And none of those need to be linked to anything. Um, wait, am I losing dam? No, that's elemental dam. We don't care about that. Okay. Still need a shield though. Could definitely still use a shield. Um, I guess we just send it here. I guess we just send it here. Filled up our gel for. Okay, hold still. Alteration is super fucking important. Oh, come on, I just wasted this whole fucking aura. Plague Bearer is absolutely crazy. I, I just can't get over this fucking ability. Um, oh, I skipped that one. See, this is the thing with like the whole lube filter thing, like, like not being able to see shields on the ground. So, so I know what I would like to find a replacement to craft on. I mean, eventually the vendor's gonna have one. It'll be plenty. Like the vendor ones are plenty high enough item level, right? It's like mostly the same shit as what drops anyway. Sometimes higher if it's really in the act, but still, it would be nice to scoopity scoop one up. Wait, where am I going?
Hmm. Cool Goliath Gauntlet. I really like the idea of getting Armor Evasion Hybrid though. What do I do? I feel like the dodge chance, like every little, every little bit of a layer, you know? And we do have evasion on the tree just from passing through stuff. So it's like, those nodes would be wasted if we didn't actually have evasion anywhere. Like, not that we're as, like, even worse than wasting the nodes is wasting potential defense, right? Like, not even the nodes themselves, it's just wasting potential defense. It's like, well... Let's find more scuffed monsters. I fought this bitch with a tor tormented spirit on one of the one of the tunes, and it was fucking terrifying. Did he get fucking clapped already? Not even played yet. I was sitting on my plague for a while, I totally forgot about it. I got so intent on like trying to dodge. Where are you going? I see you. Ooh, I almost had scuffed positioning there. As per my usual. I hate these balls. I don't I don't understand them. Easy claps, baby. <laughs> I haven't done that in a while. <laughs> making so many new I was making that every time I defeated like a, a major boss at one point. And at this point I've I've had to make so many new fucking tunes I forgot. I've, I've just been forgetting about it. Are you feeling I heard something drop way back here. What are you? Oh, yeah, the essence. Duh. Thought there was a beast because I saw Einar. Why am I like permanently bleeding? I will now not. Do I care about the yellow? I feel like in SSF I probably do care about him. Come on, Einhard, get, get your shit together. Cool. Look at that fucking epic shit. 
Oh, it's a red beast? Oh yeah, now it's fucking... Clean! 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 Like 40% monster HP on a red beast? Fucking clean! We've ascended! We have fucking ascended. Oh fuck, Dodri. Oh fuck. <laughs> shit, we might be talking shit a little a little early. Oh wait, Dodri is all fizz. Okay, wait, I did get diamond skin. Um I might try to get this fucking cluster too. Just like get as much armor as humanly possible. Um I'm trying to think how beefy I was when I last fought her. I feel like 2.5k life that I have is a bit low. It's, it's actually, like, definitely not, but just for the OG, I'm just, I'm just so, she scares me. Good nowadays, like for real. Um, oh, wait, let's go. Nope. You know, now that I think about it, the fact that I'm not gonna have any endurance charges, I think that's that means like to compensate for that, like for really you know heavy shit later on, I'm gonna need like every possible like armor bonus node like I could find. Um, the quick defenses from shield thing would actually be good, but like I think percent armor in itself is gonna be huge. Especially if I'm getting armor and evasion rating on the gear, like it's not even just gonna be like a huge fucking stacked armor chest and gloves, and, you know, like it's gonna be a mix, so it's gonna be like kind of half and half. So I think like, oh wait, this would be big, because this is more reduction and... Because there's no, uh, there is, I'm trying to think, I guess physical dot is like bleeding would be the only thing this isn't really stopping. I mean, like, I definitely want this, right, and then we'll get those two. I'm trying to think, like, how much can I possibly get? I'm at 25% right now without Fort, like, with Fort. Oh, it doesn't show it? Oh, it used to show it. Oh, hmm. Bullshit. Maybe it was just champ. I think with, like, champ, or... Juggernaut or with someone I feel the thing that says you always have fort. I think it was Jug. One of them I could have sworn as soon as I took that it was like it just added the 20% or whatever. Right onto that number. I could be I could be going crazy. It's very possible. Okay, so then that's oh wait, there it goes again. Alright, but that's probably on holy might. I don't think that it's defense. I think it's showing it. I'm just losing my mind. It just doesn't always update that, like, visual.
Mm. If she starts red, I'm just gonna pop the valve like as soon as possible. Of course she does. That's actually purple. Yeah, I lied. Those things just look red. Hmm, two, you know what? I don't like it. There's too many of them. Problem is, I don't think I like the next one at all. Yeah, that was the red one. I'm like watching my stacks as close as I possibly can. Yo, let's set up some flamethrower traps. We're gonna sneaky color. Oh shit, what are you doing over there? You fucking... You whore? Can you die? Can you please die? Oh no, my trap's gone. No, no, I'm out of flasks. We're just gonna go to town and get our flask because this is hilariously close. Like... Okay, there we go. <laughs> I just don't want to get like over like the timing was a little sketch. Am I not incubating? Oh lord. Doji's down. There's no way the Ankh is this close, right? Looks like it. Like a little side area like this. I think, um, was that side area? Yeah, that side area was that shit, shit, shit. Ha! <laughs> I like two stepped away for a second, I was like, yeah, you're gonna die. Oh no, I'm not gonna be able to catch that. No. Give me that third stack, baby. Whoa, that was that was AIDS. I just ran into AIDS. No, no, I'm out of space. Oh, we got the three. Okay, good. Nice. That's a lot of rares. Wait, 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 that's a lot of rares. I love how just seeing any rares at all because the league is like, oh my god, rares! <laughs> they do exist! They do exist! They are not just myths! Did you do a second lab yet? Oh, I totally forgot! <laughs> Yo, scuffed! Scuffed! <laughs> oh! I mean, no, no. I was, I was waiting. I was, I was, uh, I was saving it. I was saving it. Mhm, mm mhm. Mm I, d I did not completely forget. I was saving it. Totally saving it. Ooh, attack speed, fire res, a lot of evasion rating. I can put some scuffed life on there. It'd still be better than the one I have. Honestly, the one I have is fucking nothing. It's got a lightning res, which I can probably get rid of, honestly. Let's 
Let's see what we can do with that. Just because it's like, it's not amazing, but like ours is so fucking bad. Shaw Greens ain't bad either. Card level 55. Ooh, 14 all res with strength, and it has a prefix. Oh. Oh. Oh my. Ooh, this would be the one to replace if possible. Do we really want to actually? Um... Oh yeah, the strength is more life. Yeah. I'm just throwing like everything under the sun at these fucking rings. Um. Oh yeah, did I get you? Okay, next level we get another nice fucking node. Um, but you know what we gotta do? We gotta check this guy for an armor EV shield or even just a flat armor. Oh, here we go. 130, 130. Block recovery is really good actually. 23%, 24%. 131, 23. I want that extra 1% for the tiny bit less. That's big dick right there. That's big dick. We're gonna try and outdo this shield. That's the goals. 574 evasion rating. That's actually gonna be actually really big. It's one of these speed. This one. How much move speed? 25. Send it. Oh. Oh. Oh my. Those resists are so fucking scuffed. God damn it. They're so scuffed. But. That's an upgrade. Yeah, we'll probably. I think we'll do it. Um, the. Like, we'll do the lab. But like now that we're, especially now that we're like, you know, s scooping some upgrades, like I feel a little better about it. It's like the shield was scared. It really bothered me for a while. Um, how can I make this better? What's a good? Max, yes, that's not good. What about strength? Chance to block. Oh, fuck. Here we go, boys. Here we go. So that's hybrid life. So I can still put flat life on there. It has absolutely no resists. But it has 27% block chance with 8% block projectile attack damage. And 2% chance to dodge attack hits. What the fuck? That's so much blood. What the fuck? That's so good, but I really... You know what? I don't need the resists right now. So let's do this. I will need the resists at some point. Just not right now, right? Yeah, not right now. We have we have way too fucking many resists. Let's just like use what we got, because then later on when we need the resists, we'll have like a much better shield to fuck with, right? Put big boy life on this. We still have open resists on the chest that I totally haven't even remembered to craft. I want to craft them just so I don't forget that they're there. So that's fire. Let's put pure fire. Fuck it. Three. C I mean, yeah. Okay. Oh, we still have this. <laughs> no wonder we don't need resists. <laughs> We're still using a fucking gold room. Um, scuffed much. Can I, uh, problem with the flask is like you really don't want to waste any currency fucking making them because they're so low, you know? Onk is good. We gotta finish where we were at. We just had to stop the fucking... A detour here. So wait, what are we even doing for our second lab? Who are we? Oh, a Pathfinder. <laughs> right, we're getting the big juice. Don't we get the juice? We get the juice.
Yeah, we get big juice with the next slam. Hear that, or are you just like ninja sneaking flash charges? Like, we probably want the juice, but we could do the juice and then like refund it when we do the third layup. The thing is, this would actually be better for the third layup. And 6% reduced. It's not less, it's reduced elemental damage taken, but that's still really good. Um, even though our resists are gonna be capped. So, like, this is really fucking good, but this is the juice. We'll decide. We'll decide in the moment, in the heat of the moment. And no matter what we decide, we will regret it, so who cares? Alright, here we go. This character will be okay though, because we're not gonna try and force Agnostic MOM down his throat like we did with our Splitting Steel guy. Which. RIP. RIP, man. Hundred seventy-two. I'm stacking up the thickest fucking poison. Oh wait, Tolman's out. Okay, now you can die. What's up, Clarissa? You see me do that? Open ass, saving you once again. No big deal. Try to fucking keep it together next time, Clarissa. I'm fucking getting sick of saving your ass. Abyssal Depths, just because. A hundred K, that should be enough, right? Oh, yeah. There you go. Here you go. A hundred K again, but Ooh, something's fucking me up. I think I really do feel blood rage like being on. Like still not in a great way. Like the attack speed's nice, getting frenzy charges is nice, but I don't know man. Ooh, blueprints. Baby baby. Blacker garbs chancing all of these. Can I make room? What do I not want? Actually, I need <laughs> alterations. Rares are like a fucking commodity. I need to make a, a YOLO tab. Chances? Is that 100% fizz damage? Wait, what? Hey, are you going? It does. 156. This required level 57. Oh, wait. We haven't touched our weapon in a hot minute. Oh, oh, this is full on prefix. That's brick. It's a good point that we haven't touched our weapon in a hot minute. Fucking gore break. Ooh. Nope. Ah. 
Boom! I want to see how much this does. This is 20% armor with current current gear, which is... Two percent. That's not bad. That just means that the fortify effect, though, is is pretty damn juicy. Like being able to get fortify effect like that. Cause the f yeah. Hmm. It's interesting. Interesting for comparison. You guys want to go? Bop. Monster life. Gemlings just woke up dead. Yo! Unethical damage. What the fuck? Yo. <laughs> I hit him with my ethical blade vortex, man. I'm telling you. Oh my god. That was awesome. That was fully charged. Like, this thing apparently goes up to like 199k at whatever level it is right now. And I had it fully juiced because I forgot to use it. <laughs> I was like, oh, let's just use it. And right as I thought that, I saw the Legionnaires and I was like, oh, that's convenient. And they just went, <laughs> they just, <laughs> they all tripped and fell over. <laughs> like, hot damn. Plague Bearer is insane. Oh my god. What's cool is like the build itself only gets me there quicker, um, but to any build, like even shitty, can eventually get to that many stacks. It's just the whole point is like this build gets there pretty quick. And that's what like makes it you know good. But it's just so cool that Plague Bearer is like I can't believe I've never messed up the skill before. This is so cool. Oh wait, Hydra Scales. Like we did just roll really good boots already, but. Never gonna pass up a good pair of Hydra skills. Already linked and everything too, I mean, shit. Oh, we're maxed again. Meow. 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 Oh, we're out. Where am I going? Oh, here we go. We gotta go in the building. Oh, we still forgot to do our lab. We bonked him. <laughs> like, savage, you bonked him. Good, thank you, thank you. Is this still Corolla Radio? Oh, shit. So, um, no, we've been doing, um, I think it's... Yeah, I'm probably gonna get banned for fucking copyrights, but we started doing like NCS playlists, um, 
and it just kind of went on its own tangent now. I want like a radio for it, but like, there's only so many, right? I mean, how many songs? 294. Yeah, let's start over with this. It's on shuffle, so I just picked a random one, which is nice. Oof, yeah. <laughs> Dude, I love Cruella Radio though. Like that's, like if I'm not streaming, that's like almost always my go-to. I mean, it's really just Cruella. Like Cruella in themselves, I'm like humongous fans of, but the radio gets like that type of music. Wait, so there's co wait. I missed the waypoint. Son of a whore. I think it's up that way, that's how it works. Yum. So awesome. what's my hit chance looking like? Oh, very good. It's fine. It is totally fine. I think that's a precision. It's actually really cool. Instead of running the go-to like malevolence, I'm doing flesh and stone for just insane defense. And then the, that actually opens up a little bit of extra mana, and I'm using that on precision for the crit and accuracy. And my accuracy is just magically covered. Like that's that's such a good thing. Um, that that's pretty much passive points. Honestly, that's like passive points on the tree just for for the mana. Rise. Like crit chance is still completely fucking scuffed. Up. <laughs> like that's still not not uh, not happening. But you know. You know, we're not really trying to scale crit anyway, we're just not trying to spend an ASI amount of points to get resolute technique. That might be a min-maxing thing later though, but we'll, we'll have to see. We'll have to get to that bridge when we cross it. It's a lot of shit on the ground. Our viewed helmet is all, all armor, right? Yeah. Hey, how you doing? Meow. Whoever invented Plague Hair is Plague Bearer is like a five-head genius, because like the way the skill works is so fucking cool. It always loses that same percentage, but it's a percentage, so you stack it up, and you can cancel it, but you can't just like keep using it and canceling it because of the way it works, it'll keep making itself weaker, it's, it's so fucking five head. Like, seriously, this guy definitely was not involved in heist. Alright, let's uh, can you get out of your fire? Like, can we actually have a fight? Okay. Yeah, you just gave me juice, dude. You didn't want to do that. Okay, then. Oh, wait. No, I'm going in. Let me just... That's a boss. 
Um, that was a boss. I want to chance that thing in like fucking bulk. Like bulk chances. For voting of efficiency. Um. No. No. I knew that one was sucked because that was a 13th alchemy. Like, I definitely need to find like two more alchemies before I alch anything. Like, for sure. Oh, isn't this. What is this? Attack speed, fizz dam, damage with ailments. Big attack speed, accuracy, melee strike range. Mmm. Fuck. This is like so right on my. Isn't this one bleed though? Yeah, we don't really care about that. But this one's actually really up my alley. But what were we just talking about? Fort effect. Honestly, I think. Mmm. You know what? We should take a detour and get some life. Like, let's scoop these up. We've been getting all kinds of cool effects and shit. Um. Let's, like, not sleep on the fact that life exists. There are two nice ones there, too, but... Let's start working these fives. It's like, this is cool. We have, like, all of these. We have this. We have two more there. Like, we have a lot of potential percent life still right here. This is, like, Ranger is literally, like... Almost exclusively just there for the Ascendancy. Almost. Like, there's definitely stuff we could be getting. I don't want Fakro. Fuck you, Fakro. You failed me every time. Alright, um... I'm gonna talk to Mimosa. Who gives me a passive point. Sweet. And... It's time, boys. 3k life. Fortify. Let me go in there. It's time for lab number dos. Numero dos. Where we then have an identity crisis trying to figure out what choice we make at the end. Numero dos with Fortify, level 60, 3k life, um, 32% fizz reduction, 34% dodge chance, or evade chance, a little splash dodge there, 37% chance to block damage, 45% chance to block projectile damage, um, fucking just thickness everywhere just pure unadulterated thickness pure unadulterated thickness oh god and we do this am i in the right lab yep i'm not gonna get to go into them with stacks i have to build up my stacks in the fight because it always like resets everything when you walk in there to avoid you cheesing it Honestly, like, the second one, now that I think about it, it's not usually that much. It's a lot like the first, where it's really not scaled up that much. Um, but what's going to be interesting is with the 40% life. Like, it's always an issue, but... I just held on to all my charges, and I'm about to lose them. Yeah, that was, that was a waste. Alrighty. We're gonna try it with Blood Rage at the start. If it gets ugly, um, I guess I let it drop because I don't know where it is in my gear. Oh, he's dead. Like, literally by the time I popped, this thing was only at 70k. And by the time I popped that he was faced, so that was, that was, um, the cool news though is that I can just use that all the way through here. If I don't pop, if I don't pop Blood Rage, I should actually have a decent amount of life regen, like not to just aimlessly run through these, but I like shouldn't be too, you know. I shouldn't be scuffed here. If it's ugly, I can just like remember to run into a corner. 
you know. Also, I feel like this is not the right way to go. Well, maybe it is. Nope. Nope. Oh, hey, how you doing? Wait, where's my fat reward? Here it is. This is like scuffed of an area. <laughs> Let me just get this thing and get the fuck out of here. <laughs> um, you know what? I kind of want to kill these for absolutely no reason. Is that bad? There we go. Fuck you too. Got him. <laughs> okay, I feel better. <laughs> Yeah, we could use the movement speed flash. We do need to, well, we don't need to, but we'd like to get our granite. Is that a trial? Oh, no, it's not. Okay, good. Oh, wait, what did we, did we get impenetrable? This is, we actually have armor now. We actually have armor now, so this is. Does it cap at 40? Because that literally only gave us like 4%. That seems that seems shit, honestly. It doesn't seem good at all. Oh, whatever. Whatever, we don't need it. Armor. Oh! Yeah, that's it. Yeah, not from the shrine. This shrine isn't doing a goddamn thing, but I mean just like us in general. Like I'm failing at this so badly. <laughs> so we just turn around, like it's like, um, wait a minute, wait a minute, let me let me regain my composure here. What the hell just raped that guy? That was weird. I like turned into a lightning boy. It was very weird. I wanted to get, I saw like a lightning thing running and I just got the fuck out of there. I was like, don't know what's going on. Don't know why it looks like he's on my team. I want nothing to do with it. Lightning? Not it. <laughs> Not it, fam. Oh, I think I want to kill these actually. Oh wait, I can't. Well, that answered that. What's up, fam? Are you about to phase already? Like I didn't, I didn't do Plague Bear yet. Oh, let me run away so I can Plague Bear. Scuffed. <laughs> I'm, ugh, I wish my last lap was gonna go like this well. I feel like it, I'm hoping it'll go well, but there's no way it goes this well. This is like kind of troll. Every time I do lab, I'm gonna think of that one lab on the that last tune that I like just barely narrowly escaped death. Went back into the entire on the last phase, went back into the entire lab again, won it just to then die on Katana <laughs> right after. <laughs> like so scuffed. <laughs> so scuffed. Oh, uh, this is a big ass room. I've never seen this. Fucking, you can have an entire party in here. What the fuck? Catering and shit? Labyrinth traps are disabled in the truck. Wait, what? Traps are disabled? It's, I think it's only talking about the final trial, but that's awesome. I think that's. Really? Like. It's gonna make it, like, too easy. Oh, wait, here's the door. Let me kill this thing. Come on.
Oops. Mm. Yeah, look at that. That's a beautiful sight. That's what I should do when I get to like my Merc and my Overlabs. That's what I should do. Farm until I get a Traps or Disabled Dark Shine. Like only run it on that. Double keys. <laughs> Silver branch. Good. Thank you. Boots. Let's send it. These are good boots. Ooh, that's good. Oh fuck, I wish the boots were better now. That's really good. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Do we? <sighs> Flask applied, do you have 5% feet increased effect? That's pretty big. Um, or 15%. Uh, either way, they have increased effect. So. Do I go with Nature's Boon? And we start being. Flasky boy. We essentially already are. So I think flask means all flask. So that's in every five seconds they have 15 charges, right? So if you figure you need like 30 charges for a lot of, for the big ones. And 20. It'll be like you get a little more than 32. But I think we go for it. I think we go, you know what? Mm. I have a bad feeling I might regret that, but we're, <laughs> we're just gonna keep making the passive tree as thick as humanly possible. And uh, we're, we're just gonna do unethical DPS in Ethics League. Like, I, I don't know what else to say. I don't know what else to say, it's just what you gotta do. It's just what we have to do. I feel like it's a lot easier to justify like very offensive um, ascendancies like that when your entire pit, almost like the majority of your passive tree is devoted to tankiness and you're getting like almost like maybe like a total like five points that are actually like um, offense. All the rest are defense and or utility, pretty much all defense. Although I consider the attack speed life leech one utility. I guess it's technically offense, but I mean, you know, tomato, tomato. What the fuck? I just gibbed everything. Yo, oh my god, my, my shit's full again. Wait, what? Okay, now it's out. As long as I have a flask, I have a chance to do double damage, and then the shit will skyrocket. Hundred my oh my god, like oh my god, this is crazy. This is Coco Shikaku. Can I get over there? No. Okay, that's fine. Whatever. 150k, yeah, I mean. Um, you know what? I am gonna kill this guy. I don't need to, or really should, but I just have the desire to. Plus, we have a blood rage, too. Oh, 
Oh wait, I've been full. Oops. Crip, block attack, oh, mm, that ain't bad, it ain't good, but it ain't bad. Ooh, increased evasion rating, ooh, do we have an elk? Like, didn't even do anything. Alright, we're gonna put this over in the maybe corner. In the, in the discussion corner, for, the, for f discussion. Oh, that's Gargoyle, I thought that was undone, that's undone. Put the can we, can we just put this? Yeah. Yes. Okay. These in there. Whoops. Can we gems? Can we this? Move that back up. Uh, let's move that there. Bad luck. Okay. Okay. Alright, we're gonna have to call it soon. It's kind of it's. Normally I'd like to be up a little longer, but I gotta do some weird ass driving tomorrow for work. At some point in the very, very near future, I'm gonna have to call it, but this is just so damn fun, it's hard. Um, I don't think I have freeze immunity. Oops. At least you're getting close maps. Yeah, right? Like, like this guy is... He's fucking sending it. And I really think, like, the steel guy, I'm... I really think, like, regardless of whatever bullshit happened with that bat and, like, that whole unethical-like nonsense, I really think, like, the whole making the switch to... Mom Agno was a bad idea. Like, on paper, it should have been good. Um, it should have just been like a ZDPS, like more defensive swap. But I really think, for whatever combination of reasons, it was just, it was more armor that I was not getting, more evasion that I was not getting. I don't think Acro Phase Acro was doing many favors. It definitely didn't in that death, because I got hit twice in a row. Despite having, like, literally four or five different layers of completely negating damage. Which, that was actually, that in itself is an insane, insanely low chance to happen. Um, but, you know. I really think, I really think this is like, I took that, that scuffness, and I hopefully, like, learned a lot from it. Because, like, Katava's not a hard fight. Like, I've gotten a lot of, like, hardcore characters through Katava. Like, that shouldn't have happened. But I think it's one of those things where, like, a once in a blue moon, sh like, craziness happens. And... You, you learn from that to like try to best prepare yourself to prevent like once in a blue moon things you know that dude was fucking jacked there was a lot of weird things hitting me for big damage there
Like this fucking, this shit that he's doing, this is gonna crush maps. Like this fucking speed, speedy bullshit with Plague Bearer. It's gonna be insane. I'm just gonna like, chill. Dude, I love these deliriums. I'm actually finding rares. It's like, like what? Okay, here I have to be careful though for the spiky boys. Yep, yep, yeah. Yeah, that's one thing that I don't really have, like... Um... Hmm. Like, I've got a lot of fizz damage reduction, but it's still, like... It's almost never enough for them, you know? Oh, what the fuck? Look at all my debuffs. Holy shit. That was crazy. I was like, hey, I'm taking damage. And I look at my debuff list and it's longer than my fucking ass cheeks on a Tuesday night. Like, what the hell? <laughs> well, like, it wasn't like a close call, but it was like... You know, I'm very thick, so when I start taking, like, big chunks of damage, I'm like, well, what's going on? Well, what's, uh, what are we talking here? You know, what's the, what's the full in one? What's happening? Let's back out. Take a step back. Plus six life. Nice. Sell this. This thing's bad luck. Let's get rid of it. TP here because I don't know what the fuck's going on. Oh, there's like stacking. Um, like how am I perma withered? <laughs> Yo, that last two seconds when I cast it, this dude's got some bullshit going on. Yo, what the fuck? Oh, dude, so close. Like, what? I saw some weird symbol for a second, I get so hyped. Oh shit, that was a steel jewel. Shit. Increased AoE that- Wow, I got the good one. Wow. Wow. Oh god. Mortemius is actually really good. Um, I'm not doing claws, but I'm actually not expecting anything specific. Super big crit chance of poison on hit. This is like, you could use this for like blade vortex and actually deep dick things. Trying to lure them away so I don't pop them all at once. Ooh, ooh. Just, just pop, 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 pop. Okay. Um.
Oh, hey, how you doing? I just realized I don't have a cast from damage taken either. That's definitely an important layer that I should, should figure out. Pivot. Oh, I guess on my scuffed ass helm. What do I want? Cast boy, much ouch ouch. Yeah, yeah, dude, that guy, that guy was casting ED Contagion. Like, I don't know if you saw that. was fucking. <laughs> and he had Wither Totems. For the record, I'm not allowed to use Wither Totems because of the league rules. But that fucking NPC was. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Fucking unethical. Unethical enemies. Mm-hmm. Gotta watch out. Gotta watch out, man. At least don't give a shit about ethics. Let's let me hold on to these for when I die. Should probably put them more to me. So, eh. I forgot about that thing. It's so good, but it has a yes. Fuck him. Fuck him. Am I even cursing? Yeah, yeah, I am. Um, that there. Alright, let's see how rough Yugal is, because she's always a bit of a whore. Always a bit of a whore. My steel guy did pretty good on her, but this was before he made his unfortunate slow demise of a choice to switch over I think this portal will be closer just in case I got 214k for this boss. Yo, where are you at? Oh, my Lanta. Oh shit, I should have canceled that earlier. Whatever. You're juking him. Two step on your bitch ass. Where's the boss at? 151? This will do. Oh shit, is that her? Yeah, that's her. Not gonna- that is a big splooge party. What the fuck? They're still chasing me. Yo, watch this. Watch this. Coke! <laughs> Cheesy as shit. Yo, my health never went down. What the fuck? <laughs> what the ethical fuck? Yo. What the ethical fuck? Woo, right? Fucking woo. And big health node. 3.2. So. We're actually at like. Technically. Like, so for a soft. If this was a soft core build, right? Um, we would already be at the stats we need to finish the entire game. Like, not even kidding. We would already be good. We have enough health reductions, defensive layers, everything. Well, we would need to put cast from damage taken on, because I'm dumb and I keep forgetting. But, like, that's it. Like, we're good already to finish the whole fucking game. Because of the, like, the health pool and everything. This is kooky, Chicago. And we're getting more. Like, we're not done getting defense, because I am so fucking sick of dying. <laughs> I'm so fucking sick of dying. Is that armory V? No. How did I pick that up? 
No. Contract. Oh my god, we're gonna do so good in contracts. I can't wait. That's actually gonna be awesome. That's actually gonna be so fun. You know what? This guy deserves. Why do I not have a weapon MTX? Like, fucking get it. Like, what's going on here? Oh, because I keep switching my weapon. That That's actually a good reason. That reminds me, should I be, like, making a new weapon? I, I don't think I really can. Doesn't mind have, like, poison damage on it. That's part of why I'm so fucking insane right now. Electric garb. No. That's actually, that just reminds me, Chaos Res is what I need. That's why that guy was such, that other guy was so painful. That's my one resist that's like completely scuffed. Like, generally, like, I know closer I get to endgame, the better I get at, at that. But, like, right now, I'm still... The lack of rares dropping, like, that's probably, like, all other things aside, that's probably the biggest hit at all parts of the game, is making it that much harder to find ways to get Chaos Res. Like, that much harder. And like, I doubt I'm gonna be able to trade for Chaos Essences. If I can, it'll be so few of them, you know? I kinda wanna try, like, not trading, too, for as long as I can on this guy. That was an arcanist? That could be good. Freezes when activated. I do not... Oh, I do have a heat. Oh, okay. You so hydras. What's up? actually picking up stuff. These lack of guards are dropping like candy right now. It's kind of sweet. I want to fill up the tab before I bother chancing them. Prefixes are full. If that had chaos, I'd probably use it anyway. Honestly, like... So desperate for Chaos Rose. Actually, you know what? So desperate for Chaos Rose. Nope. Oh well. Oh well. So desperate for Chaos Rose. Apparently talking about it is not helping the situation. Um, do I need int? I just realized I have unleveled gems. Oh, we need int. Feels bad. Oh shit, wait, we already got the int node. Isn't there another one? Oh, this is actually good. We could do these two. It's gonna help a little. It's not like a long-term fucking problem solved. We have 40 on our enemy already too. Yikes. Yikes. Oh, here's one. Oh, thank god. Oh, thank god. Can we refund? What's the last thing we put into? Oh, I think it was a big sexy node. Oh well. Feels bad. Feels kind of bad.
242k stacks. Go. Play. Oh, I just got that fucking point back. Nice. finish the act we're just gonna finish this act and then we'll we'll call it a night at this point like i'm just fucking feeling so much juice it's not ascendancy that like like we were already juicing pretty hard but like that ascendancy just like oh, could that be the stairs Ascendancy did like way more than it should have for damage. Like it, because uh, the thing is, if it wasn't for Plague Bearer, the Ascendancy is definitely big and it's definitely like awesome, but it's like exponentially better because we're actually using Plague Bearer for like all of, like a lot of clearing and damage. And there's like a big synergy there. Resist chaos. Oh, I was like, for some reason, I'm like not really getting stacks too fast. Um, right here should be enough. Yeah. I mean, we like didn't have to move. That felt amazing. Like, I literally face tanked pretty much every single shot he had, and my health didn't go down, and we still ate him. I have zero complaints with that fight. <laughs> that, like. I feel like even if I fuck up and die, I need to make this same character again because this is just going too well. And like, just figure out why I died and fix that. You know what I mean? Like, this just—I'm actually having too much fun. This is actually like in a normal league too. I'd have Wither Totem, like oh my god. My cull could be like an actual totem instead of this scuffed flamethrower trap I have to kill. No, I want that essence. Oops. I 
feel like I keep these stacks going into that. I don't know why, but I feel like I keep my stacks in there. We're gonna test. Item full. Imagine if they let me keep my stacks for this fight. Okay, I don't know why. I just thought I've like never really seen a load screen for this fight. Just led me to believe that that's what's going on here. All right, it's not as unethical as I thought, but definitely, definitely not bad. Ooh, hey. Oh, it's that black shit. I always forget to, like, not stand in it. Like, every time. Until I'm, like, losing all my health. No, we're getting a safety net. I'm getting, like, scuffed placement of everything in here. Ow. Do I have flasks? I have no flasks. Not a real pathfinder. Not a real pathfinder, by the way. Hmm. All the ground degens. Like, it makes the fight very dragged out, but you can't, like, not. Hey, hey. I think it's Blood Rage too, like I really need to stop using Blood Rage. Dude, what the fuck? She's standing in the dead center of a black circle. Like, what? Come on, bitch. Can you be cold? No, just kidding. How about I just do this instead, okay. Um, oh, she did give me flask, so... Alright, that was a lot, like, I played it pretty well, but it didn't feel anywhere near as, like, ridiculous. Something about the degens. Maybe they're doing chaos damage? And my resists are still amazing. Hmm. Oh wait, the vines. Nice. All right, we're gonna hit this, and then we're gonna finally call it a night.
Alrighty. Alrighty. So, so for tomorrow, we're gonna have to seriously figure out where in God's name we're getting chaos resistance from. <laughs> like, like, really figure that shit out. Um, the passive tree. I think we want to do. Obviously, we want to do more life investment for no worry for no reason. Thank you for sharing. Not. Thank you for showing up, Keith. I appreciate it very much. You know, always nice to uh, hang out with everybody. Um, yeah, today was good though. I think. I mean, yeah. Last night the character died, which sucks. Um, we had like multiple identity crises, as I always do. That's that's like literally just normal for me now. Um, but I think we, we bounced back, like, not to, I mean, we'll see how the character turns out in the long run, but I just, I feel like, I feel like we have, like, a, a strong base here. Um, I just can't come down to, like, I really think the gear is going to be my biggest thing, is really, like, just, you want to get, like, four to five, but I want to get a few more things, I gotta get the cast damage taken, that's big. I gotta make a note of that. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna go buy one and just put it right in my inventory so I go, oh yeah, for tomorrow. <laughs> but that's probably. Yeah, yeah. It was good. It was good. I'm having a lot of fun on this guy. Alright, so thank you everybody for tuning in. Wait, I think I like this song a lot. Oh, I think I really like this song. Oh, my shit didn't save. People are ruining my, my intermission screen here. Alright. So this is him so far. All his glory. Uh, hopefully we can make some moves with this. Have a lot of fun. Thank you everyone for tuning in today. I uh, appreciate it. Hope everyone has a wonderful night. Please uh, stay safe. And take care. Enjoy your night. Um, I should be on tomorrow night as usual. Uh, it's probably going to be around like 7 or 8 Eastern time. Same as always, you know me. Um, but yeah, that's it. Everyone have a good night. Take care. Thanks for stopping by. And uh, make sure you don't die. Hardcore sucks. Okay, bye! Bye-bye! Bye-bye! Bye! -bye. bye, -bye. bye, -bye.